Yo, yo. <laughs> All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yo, yo, yo. Uh. Okay. VOD watchers. Okay. VOD watchers VOD skip watcher. five hours, man. All right, we got a lot of side quests to do. <laughs> Please just do MSQ. <laughs> Fuck, dude. I don't even know where to start. Bro. <sighs> Let's just go down the list, man. <laughs> dude, I don't even know where to start, man. <laughs> Oh, God. All right. So Dravosht is still standing. For now, at least. If you can swing a hammer. <laughs> you got Five. You're here. And the Akashic. It's not going to be that bad, man. It's Mostly off to bad. the north still. But I spoke to Doris' scouts, and it turns out things are worse than I thought. There's swarms of them out there. Told old Snotty to be ready to seal the north gate. That should buy us some time if we need it. Enough for the villagers to barricade themselves inside their homes, at least. Well done. Welcome back. Sid. I'd never have guessed, you know. Not if August hadn't let slip. Who'd have thought mm -hmm. that the savior of Dravosht would turn out to be the realm's most infamous outlaw. Keen to help us out again? I am. Thought you could sneak off without me, did you? Blackthorn. Oh, what are you doing here? One of the scouts couldn't keep his voice down. Unlike my best mate who didn't think I deserved to know. Zoldan, how long's it been? Long enough for us two to turn into a pair of old coaches, I see. Then your idea of an apology. Prick. Good afternoon. Damn! To me. You only did what you thought was best. For the village and that. Good afternoon, Good. Zenosis Vex. Yeah. The Bird Council reminds you of the delay tithing of seeds. We shall take it into consideration upon the next Welcome. meeting of the Council. Our Thank master. you. Enjoy your day. He didn't Bird's leave lead. the chieftain to the two of us. He left it to me. The best blacksmith in Travosht, barring himself, of course. <sighs> Bloody stupid tradition, in my opinion. If someone's got talent, you should let them practice their craft, not ask them to settle petty feuds and barter for grain. Our master wasted half his life that way. I wasn't about to let that happen to me. We're doing all the side quests. So wasted half of mine instead. You're what Travosht needed. Under me and my precious ideals, this place wouldn't have lasted a year. So I left to devote myself to the work and spare you lot the consequences. I may be a selfish prick, but I only did what I felt I had to. What you had to do was your duty. Even if it meant we all starved? Enough. This is no time for bickering. You can finish beating each other up once Dravosht is safe. Fine. I've said my piece anyway. Yeah. So have I. Sorry, Clive. I shouldn't have stuck my nose in. We're short enough on mm. time as it is. Still, give Why us some drummer always eating, so I gotta eat, man. 
I need to get my head straight before any of them are trying, trying to bite it off. You, uh, ready for the off, then? We can't afford to waste any more time. Right you are. Yeah, Might be worth having one last word with the scouts, though. Don't want any nasty surprises, do we? Oh, and mm. Blackford, you and Zoltan might be better off staying inside the... Akashic on the move. How close are they? Within sight of the walls, and there are more coming up from the mines. <sighs> what was I saying about nasty surprises? They'll wash right over us if we stay out in the open. We're pulling back behind the gates. Good idea. Get yourselves inside, but keep your weapons handy. Understood. All that eating and no seeds for the council. Well, let's hope you don't. Dude. That's our job. Once the scouts are Birds inside, leave. order your men to barricade the gates. No heroic last stand, you hear me? No fighting at all if you can help it. August's right. I've seen what Akashic beasts can do to armor. The people here are tough and willing, but they ain't equipped to face what's coming. I'm going out there. Start work on the gate as soon as I've left. I'll give you as much time as I can. And if they kill you, you evacuate. Man, they're not gonna kill. Won't come to that. Kill Clive. He's fucking Ifrit, man. <laughs> You'd better be right. Take good care of Dravosh till I get back. Leave it to me. And give those things what for, yeah. Oh shit, it's big. All right. Which one of you's first? Breath out, dragon breath in.
my god, look at this dagger, look at this dagger. That's sick, man. That's sick. Hmm. Now, the question is Did I miss any? Such an easy game? No, I'm just really good. No, I'm just really good. Man I'm what you could call an expert. You're still in one piece. Okay, a professional. Okay. I slew as many as I could. Is it? Is it? As many as I could, he says. The old bleeding lot more like it. Well, almost. Only almost. Yeah, one or two did try to sneak over the wall. But we got the bastards, don't you worry. Good. Though you do know, more will come in time. In time, yeah. But we can think about them later. Let's get you back inside. Yeah, this is like the longest demo, man. Like what? Oh. Sid! <laughs> You're even more fearsome than your reputation. Man, this was a pretty cool quest. I monsters nightmares. I almost felt sorry for the wretched things. I like quests where you get to kick but ass, mostly, man. mostly, I felt grateful. <laughs> I got to show with, the, with the one girl. What you did today. I'm afraid I've only delayed the inevitable. There's no getting rid of that ether flood. Meaning that any living thing which stumbles into those mines will end up clawing at your walls again. No kisses, no Unless rack, no bins, spread. no seed. Oh my god. If it does, well, I hate to say it, but the village's days are numbered. When will this that demo That may end? be, but I we're know. staying just the same. With the ether flood springing up all over, it's no less safe than anywhere, and more importantly, it's our home. We'll fortify the gates to the north. And I'll see that they're guarded day and night. All right. Okay. Then we'll give you a hand shoring up those defenses. How many side quests we got to do? We got to do like 10. As for you, Blackthorn, that's twice you've turned up when Dravosh needed you. So, thanks. I shouldn't have stayed away so long. And I shouldn't have left without talking it over with you first. Too bloody right, you shouldn't. Like ten. Though yeah, I, I know. Have listened. Hey guys. We talked about this. We talked about this last so night. Easy when for me, it was anything but. You leaving gave me the perfect excuse to hate you. <laughs> and from that day on, I never once stopped to wonder what it would have been like if you'd stayed. But what you said earlier, it was true. You'd have been the death of this place. Finally, something we can agree on. Yeah. Hope you see the sense you of keep it all your shit. Mm -hmm. You kept this place alive. Alive, perhaps wealthy even, but Dravoj isn't what it once was. Our work used to be the pride of Dalmechia. Now, we churn out the same rubbish day after day because it's easy and turns a profit. It's not about the craft anymore. <laughs> I wouldn't send my sons to war wearing the shit most of our smiths are making. I've kept working, honing my skills, trying to lead by example, but... 
We're going to beat the game the today. The average We're going to do these side quests and do the story. The craft is our current law. Come back to us, Blackthorn. Remind Dravosht what a true master blacksmith looks like. <laughs> and even you don't think so? Of yours if it means we can work at the same forge again. That's a kind offer. Kinder than I deserve. And I wish I could accept, but I'm needed elsewhere. There's people who trust their lives to my steel, and I dare let them down. Mm. <sighs> Fair enough. But that doesn't mean I couldn't visit from time to time. Let's see if we can't rekindle this town's passion for the craft, shall we? I'd like that. Just be sure to tell Snotty to let me in the next time I come calling, yeah? <laughs> yeah, we'll start a new game Going plus, in. like... He'd let you in anyway. Start a new game plus, Black like, Thor. tomorrow. Or tonight, the depending on how Smith's fast I get there. Back in my if new game graces. plus is literally just the entire I game over again, I'd and you have to do day. all these side quests, which, I mean, it's fine. But I'm just gonna skip all the all the side quest cutscenes. I say that I'll probably well, skip all you? the main story cutscenes um, unless they're really good, and I'll watch them. Sid, I've got something for you. Oh, and this is a token of a lasting gratitude, but. Yeah. I'm of a mind to make you a far grander gift. Designs for a certain sort. The only of side quest I'm going to watch after I beat the game are the new ones. Now hold on, Sultan. There's a reason no one's made that blade in centuries. There's not been a craftsman equal to the task. I'll admit your cinders make impressive steel, and I've learned to own an edge Odin will be proud of. But the engravings on that thing are enough to make a jeweler cry. And they're not just for oh, sure. Oh, yeah, rare blade. Either. Have you forgotten Maybe. what brought you back to Dravost in the first place? Hmm? A certain ring? I knew I'd never surpass you with a hammer and tongs. So I turned my hand to a different kind of metalwork. Between the two of us. I'd say we're the equal of Oh, shit, am I going to get a new blade? Grace to forge. <laughs> You know what? I think you might be right. Clive, you wouldn't mind if Zoltan came back to the hideaway, would you? <laughs> He's more than welcome. As oh, long as he can keep yeah. our secret. Right. Zoltan, get your tools. We've got a legend to forge. No, this was cool. Okay. So. Um. Oh God. There's a. Oh my God. Dude, there's two quests here. What the fuck? What is this one? Bruh. Okay. So I guess. I guess we'll just do this. <sighs> nah, I'm doing them all. The way was. Doing them all. I don't know how. Take that, you naughty thing. Oh, my lord. Clive. To what do I owe the Doing pleasure? them all, boys. I just wanted to see how the town's been faring since you brought everyone together. Uh, since we brought everyone together, all is absolutely wonderful. Conrad and Natalie's hands mm -hmm. remain safely away from each other's throats. Holy, see in three days. The helm. Our stores are full, and the bandits still too disorganized to raid them. Just as the good Lady Jane and Lord Underhill intended. Are you a lord? Lubor's going to be one too. They're going to make him the Lord of Dalamil. Because of how he stopped all the grown-ups from fighting. It's the mayor of Dalamil, dear child. And the vote hasn't taken place just yet. But if the people wish me to lead them, I shall. And my first act will be to hmm. build a school so that menaces like you two can we get not side quest kisses at least. 
Speaking yes. of menaces, there may be a rather worrying one just over the horizon. I shaved my head today. Indeed. I'm afraid the example Conrad and Natalie set in putting aside their differences in presenting a united Wank front you. might have caught the bandits' attention. And they might have elected to take a similar approach. They have formed what one could call a League of Outlaws. And they grow more organized by the day. But we'll fight them all off just like last time. No matter how many of them there are. Won't we, Lubo? Of course we will. If we continue to work together, we can overcome any challenge we choose to face. The longer we avoid facing this one, the more difficult it will be. Until the only way to overcome it might be to run for the hills. Our best hope is to nip these efforts at organization in the bud. By finding those ne'er-do-wells who have yet to join the cause, and ensuring that they never do. Mm. Perhaps a certain Lord Underhill might be willing to lend us his aid. Do you once say more? butthole too, King? What the fuck? How could I refuse? No cringe concern. Thank you, my lord. Victor will fill you in on the particulars. I have him stationed by the desert gate, receiving well. escalating reports from my scouts. Well, such an amenable no. soul. No, I, mean, I don't have a hairy you. asshole. The fuck? I'll go and speak with him. Proof. What's the difference Proof? between a lord and a mayor? That's easy. One of them swings a sword, the other forges them. Shit. A league of outlaws. Sounds like we have some competition. A Wookiee stuck in a drain pipe. Did I say that? I thought I said beaver. Still in Dalamil, Victor. Ah, Sid. I thought you'd have returned to Kostnis by now. I did. Then I came back. I've developed something of a fondness for the place. And having worked <laughs> so hard to see it saved from one fate, it would seem remiss to abandon it to another. A sentiment Master Lubor certainly isn't shy about exploiting. I hope in this last segment, man, they just blast again. MSQ. I the hope they don't one. give you any side quests. What does he want you to do? Like, this is a bit bandits. too much, man. This is a bit too much. To the side quests in this game, and you've come at just the uh, right some time. of them are really awesome, actually. I but I feel like the pacing is, has been pretty good up until this point. It's been pretty decent. Vicinity, you get like two, two in between, that's fine. We but dude, you get like ten. Fuck. Soon at as Jesus. Camps as we, can. we can't give this league of theirs time nah, to nah, I gotta its do it, man. I gotta do it. I gotta do it. Which camp shall I take? There's one up river. Just out there, across the dunes. Yeah. Leave it with me. And I gotta do it. But like these, like these, like quests like these where you just have to like go and kill like a fucking bandit or some shit, man, is like, ugh. Like who cares? Those ned dwells Like I've already like I've already saved this town like four times, man. Like who gives a shit? How are there any bandits left? Good girl. You know? Run like the wind. Uh, Quentin. Quentin's, Quentin has the best side quest, I think. Although that last one we just did with the blacksmith and the chimera and stuff, that one was pretty fun. I don't mind the side quest if they have like a boss in it or something. I guess I'm just going to do that plus as well. That must be the camp Vic dimensioned. Come on then, Toggle. This guy for real, bro? <laughs> you 
Yeah, but like these, man, where you just kill normal enemies. Bleh. Like who? Who cares? I wish you could have loadouts in this game. That'd be that'd be kind of cool. You could switch to like a trash time. loadout. Sid, where are you? Ah, I see the bandits didn't you know what I mean? any trouble. No, but because That's while it's awesome here, that you can like respec everything, no. something's happened. It we can be a little tedious because the build that you want on what bosses is, is going to be severely different than the on whole track. Towns in uproar. They're saying that Lubor. Is a bear. Oh, I'm sure New Game Plus will have better trash. What? They already said that the that the monsters in Seems New Game Plus are going to be upgraded. So maybe like all of been. the little guys will be he like one of the bandits escape. Like mediums and the large and like the mediums right will be larger. Delamo. Some of the children spotted him and he was about to silence them. And when Lubor felled him with a bolt of magic and without a crystal. But that's not possible. It is if he's a bear. Some of these side quests you, you need to do years, for like which is items. What people are saying. If he has, well, I wouldn't blame him. No man is branded by choice. Still, all those people see is a man who's lied to them all his life. One who was made a leader of himself when the world believed he should have been a slave. Fuck. It's just the MSQ is so good. I don't know where we go from here. That a majority of side quests are thing. like no overshadowed by it. I mean which is a good thing right which is a good right thing now. Right. yeah some of them you need to like like this one in particular that I'm on is, is just pure 100% filler like I'm pretty sure you could not even do this and, and it wouldn't impact your gameplay at all <laughs> all I did like just all I did was come here to check up on how things are doing and we found out that there's more bandits and, and okay now everyone knows no we killed the bandits <laughs> I made it a habit to keep a crystal close at hand for just But like such the next occasion. one I'm going to do is going to give me an item. Rose, I'm not sure what it's going to give I me though. I forgot to reach for it. Well, it was bound to come out sooner or later. We're sorry, Lou. I like the hunts though. We tried to keep running, but we just couldn't anymore. There's nothing to be sorry for. I rather enjoyed playing the hero for once. All that matters to me is that you two are safe. Look at him talking to his betters like it's nothing. All lies are wager, just like the ones he fed us all these years. Why are they so salty? Once people make up their minds, it's hard to change them. We need to do something, and quickly. Convince the people not I have, to let their I, prejudices I think so? blind them. I'm not sure. Convince them that nothing has changed. I don't. Well, that their enemy lies outside. I've only killed like two S ranks. Them. You're right. I mean, I'm sure there's more in New Game Plus. I'm glad you agree. I'll handle the townsfolk. I'm a downright born and bred. They listen to me. You head to the tavern. Make Conrad and Natalie remember who Lubor really is. They know that Lubor and I are friends. I might not make for the most impartial of interlocutors. Lord Underhill of Randalar's League of Merchants, however, is a trusted and impartial mediator of... Oh, note. no new hunts? Oh, well, in that I case, can. yeah, I guess I did. Lubor, stay here with the children. I can't promise anything, but... We'll try. And that is all I can ask of you. <laughs> Why are you taking the bears? Why do they always have to make such a... You all along that he was Man, last time I was in here, dude. Forgive me for disturbing. That was like a bar you, fight. Could I have a moment of your time? Hmm. I've seen your face yeah. before. As have I. Yeah, that's what they Under said. In New Game Plus, the bosses it? some some of the bosses the are gonna merchants. have like different moves and stuff, man. Uh, that's right. I wanted to speak to you about Lubor. The rumors that he's a bearer. All true, I'm afraid. He'll never be mayor now. Not if I have anything to do with it. But what if his wares? I am you. Bearer or no, his steel is highly valued throughout the Republic. I don't think there's multiple Indians. In this, I at least doubt he's it. done the town a service. Might that not earn him a little leniency? Leniency? He pretended to be one of us when he was laughing behind our backs all the while. I'm sorry, my lord, but he lied to us. He lied to you. He cannot be trusted. So what do you propose? Will you drive him from his home? 
close his forge? Perhaps. That is a question for the people of Dalimil. And they will thank you not to get involved. The townsfolk have made their minds up. There was nothing I could do. Nor I. Conrad and Natalie refused to consider anything but their own wounded pride. You never know. Once their anger is cooled, they might see things differently. For now, we should report back to Lumbor. All right. Why the hell would Victor take the bearer's side? I assume the situation is hopeless. Man, you ain't being mayor, brother. There's still hope. But... But, perhaps not in this lifetime, I think it's fair to say. You mustn't think like that, Lubo. Give them time. They'll come around. We'll talk some sense into them in the end. You'll see. No, you won't. And your efforts would be better spent elsewhere. But Lubo... Rosina would often tell me... ...that steel does not lie. That a blade is a reflection of the smith who forged it. To yourself be true. That was her point. Rather an ironic one when you consider that her life was taken. How long the is this game? He has been playing it for like a month at this point. <laughs> but I do not doubt that she was always <laughs> true to come out and what like she Wednesday. In, right to the end. And so must I be. Bald time works differently. I must do what I know to be right, no matter has, what others. Isn't might this like the fourth me. day? And now I have yeah, I haven't played it as long. I, I mean, I've played it a lot, but I haven't played it as as so long as others have. I have something to unite I, against. For only uh, I only wanted to, to stream a crazy hours them. for one day. I'll need to make a suitably dramatic exit, of course. Don't go, Lubo. You're the only one who was ever kind to us. We'll be all alone again. Trust me, little ones. It is for the best that I go. Or yeah, I'm not nah, like I want to like I want to do these long streams, man, like today. For the best. These uh, children need you. The least you can do today is will probably be another 12 hour stream. No, it would not take it, Victor. It's over. Over, you say. And so just like that, you're going to throw this town and these children to the wolves. I thought you were better than this. But it seems you had me fooled as well. Victor. Forget it. Do what you will. Nine hour mark like lot. Wait, yesterday's stream was like 11 sure hours, wasn't it? Right choice, Lubo. Of those available to me, I believe it's Nah, we're the finishing one. the game today. Yes. Ah, but where are my manners? Here. A reward for clearing out that bandit camp. Right then. I have packing to do. Oh, I was ten. If oh. there's anything I can do. Oh no, I ended early so anything. that I could go to bed early. Yeah, no, I'll that's what I did. Bear it in mind. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Holy shit, man! Like that side quest. Like the side quest was like. Ugh, I don't know, man. Like this. I mean, they can't all be winners, you know. They can't all be bangers, but dude, like I'm. If I ever have to do the side quest again, I'm just fucking skipping this shit. Uh, okay, so I guess I'd go here. Okay. Come on. Fly, Ambrosia. Fuck. What? Oh wow, I can't I can't just go over there? Oh I'm fucking going the wrong way from an idiot.
Oh. We need to deal with these ones first. Trying to dodge it. I didn't think it'd do that much damage. Holy shit. <laughs> Holy moly. Damn, that fucking ball almost killed me in one hit. <laughs> this is it. Right then. Oh, is that it? Uh ooh, oh my god, there's another one up there. Dude, fuck off. You know what? I mean that's not too bad because we're doing all of them in one area at least. Okay, okay, okay. That's not bad. Not bad. Uh, wait, where's this fucking class? I haven't even been in this house. Lord Rossi, oh, this guy! I remember is this there guy. Is there I might assist you with this day? Perhaps. My brother said that your order was helping him with his quest to uncover Ultima's origins. Have you learned? You look extra bald today. What's the spoke? secret? Little and less. I regret. To I report. shaved my head. I see. Be assured, however, that we will not rest until the truth is known. Even now, our archaeologians scour ruins in every corner of the realm for traces of Ultima's touch. Fallen ruins, I take no, it. No, no, Panda, you. Dating back as far as Phoenix Gate. Indeed. Ultima's thralls are oft sighted among the remnants of the fallen civilization, as if protecting the secrets concealed within. Secrets we'd see unearthed. Should our methods be of interest, my lord? Mayhap it would please you to observe some of our number at work. Would that be possible? Of course. A survey has been conducted not far from here. Perchance you are familiar with Kretov. A small hamlet built around a fallen airship. I was due to visit my colleagues there to collect their preliminary findings, but... If you would consent to do so in my stead... I'm sure that they would be honored to relate any discoveries they have made to you directly. All right. Let's go. I'll go and meet with them. They will be most gratified, I am sure. Might I suggest you take the road through Titan's Wake? Wins NATO. After but a short Man, walk. I don't want to use that skill. Thank you. Man. I will. I wish you a safe I journey, can't see shit. May the Firebird's flames burn ever in your heart. And you guys always say pay to win when I use it or or have some other stupid shit. shit. Sounds like another lost wing. I hope the inhabitants are just as friendly. What? Oh, wait, I can't even go here. What? Maybe through here? Uh, okay, well, I'm going up here first. I'm doing this one. What's happened? The cards are the key. Ah, Clive. You'll be pleased to know that the negotiations are progressing well. That is good news. Yes. Our comrade in Randala has just sent word that the contract should be signed very soon. 
I hope I can I get to that area. More to prepare. It's a huge undertaking moving this many bearers at once. You couldn't do me a quick favor, could you? Hmm. What is it this time? More wild beasts? Nothing like that. I just need you to go over to the caravans and ask El how long we have until the bearers arrive. Find out exactly how much faster I need to get all these supplies moved. All right. I'll go and ask. Thanks, Clive. I owe you one. Oops. Side quests are not over yet, no. <laughs> Hopefully this one doesn't take too long. I can't believe that, like, nine popped up, man. That's unreal. That's fucking crazy. Don't Maybe blame yourself, much. El. This is their fault, not yours. I know, but... No buts about it, alright? Is something wrong? Vonnie came to give me a message from our intermediary. The talks with the Republican army have fallen through. They've reached an agreement with the Silver Peak Consortium instead. Though prices have fallen of late, we deliberately offered above the going rate to try and deter other bidders. But the Consortium offered double what we did, and the army jumped at the chance. You had no opportunity to make a counteroffer? None at all. And we were so close. El? What's happened? I, I saw Vonnie leaving. She didn't look happy. And with good reason. <laughs> but I thought we were the only ones the Fist were speaking to about the bearers. How did the Consortium even find out about this? It's not so surprising. They have ears all over the Republic. This isn't over. The Consortium will have to sell these bearers eventually. And at the price they paid, buyers will be few and far between. I'm going to Randalar myself. Alone? You sure that's wise? Are you offering to be my bodyguard? Ooh. How kind. Meet me at the checkpoint near the capital gates. I'll send an owl ahead and request a meeting. You go to Why don't you guys like Lise? And get everything ready. We've waited far too long as it is. Even if I fail to feed Yeah, why don't you guys bearers, like Lise? There will be others. Someone needs to prepare the place and keep any prowling beasts at bay. Oh, and that's me, is it? Well, this bandwagon. Like following orders till she, she dumb, gets back from, as fuck. Useless. from meeting the Silver Peak Pretty Consortium, good. who've been doing their best to undermine our scheme. She'll never join them after this, surely. No, she said it herself. She still has plans mm. for Cashlock, even if this one falls through. Well, I don't know. I just hear Lisa's she means a bad to stay character. With us, then. I can't say I'm not happy to hear it, but is this what she really wants? You have to trust her. Oh, hating Lise is kind of half right. a meme. Okay. It's what she wants now. And if Elle's off fighting for the cause, I should do my part too. So I bid you farewell and safe travels, my friend. I'll gather my men and leave for Cashlock. We'll make sure the place is well stocked and defended. You go to Randala and see if you can stop my sister biting the consortium's heads off. If she won't consider her prospects, someone has to. I'll do my best. People right. hate on Lise because there's no okay. love. I'd better not keep Eloise waiting. Yeah, today's stream will be long, man. I want to finish the game today. I want to finish the game today, so that way we can work on New Game Plus. So what's like the progression of like what of shit you need to do? You finish the main game, then you work on New Game Plus, then you work on Arcade Mode, I guess. I don't know how much Arcade Mode I'm going to do, though. Because like the game starts to become unfun for me when I when I have to grind for like perfect runs. That's when I don't, that's when I, that's when it gets, it, it gets boring for me. I don't mind doing it a little bit, but. Pee break. I actually do have to use the bathroom. Let's 
I do have old man water. I do. I actually gotta take my plate upstairs too, man. Okay, okay. Ho ho ho! And then he disappeared! And then he disappeared! <laughs> what a legend, dude. Holy shit, man. Okay, alright. <laughs> the motherfucker followed me. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, okay, I'm gonna use a potion here. Okay, I'm gonna use I'm gonna use the bathroom. I'm gonna take my plate upstairs. Um, yeah, and I'm gonna refill my drink. So I'll be here. like two minutes.
Okay. What, you heard me? Okay. I hope I didn't keep you waiting. We heard everything? What'd you hear? Consult him. Here they are now. You wish to consult with me? I did. It's about the bearers you recently purchased from the Fist. We had all but finished making arrangements to buy them ourselves. And then you stepped into the fray. Oh, no, I know. You misunderstand. The consortium had an interest in purchasing them from the very first. Yeah, I'm just doing them all, man. It was only our regard for you that kept us from bidding. But your hesitancy in accepting our offer to you suggested that the regard was not neutral. And so we resumed our business. I did not hesitate. I am simply not inclined to make such decisions without first giving them due consideration. Huh. But what is done is done. Come then. How much do you want for them? Alas, you are too late yet. Matt, thank you guys for the subs. We really thank you guys very much for all the subs. Unconventional merchandise without a purchaser. The sub count is fucking crazy. The bearers belong to him. Oh, you know. we never did beard Who points your before the stream. A trader from across the water. Oh, a most demanding fuck. fellow. If Let me do it now. He insisted the bearers be fed, dressed, even given their own bunks for the voyage over. Oh, that's, that's what nice you get when you deal with continental types. I wouldn't dude, know. this guy's a fucking cunt, dude. Oh, yes, the culture on the continent is quite different to ours. They pay good money for bearers not fit for the knacker's yard and treat them like kings. But as long as they pay... That does sound unusual. No matter, then. If they've already left our shores, there's little that can be done. Allow me to withdraw my interest. And with it, my interest in joining your organization. My associates will be sorry to hear that. Why do I feel like that guy is going to try to like get revenge or something? I'm sorry you weren't able to save them. As am I. But I only have myself to blame. He was right, you see. The Silver Peak Consortium did intend to buy those bearers before I did. Their representative hinted at a possible purchase when he came to recruit me. I feigned interest in joining them yeah, in the hope he might be encouraged to tell me more. And he did just that. How many times a week do I train? It just depends left, on the week. My own offer it also depends on my routine. So you never So like if I'm trying to go heavy, then I'll do three. But if I'm trying to go uh like proposal solely so I could learn more uh, about those bearers. If I'm trying to do like high rep, like medium to high rep. Exactly who I was dealing with. Uh, and I'm trying to focus on my technique, then I'll do like four. But the training sessions will be, they'll be uh, like slightly shorter. Like I'll usually cut one move. At least. They Or sorry, uh, yeah. So if I go heavy, I'll normally cut like one move. Badly to see them freed. So like to give you an example. The village is under attack. My current routine a right now is I do three heavy mountains. days one and week, and then the week after head. that. Theo and the others are trying to hold Yo, I called this they shit. Can, they're gonna, they're the fucking trying to get them. revenge. They need help and fast. Um. Theo. I'll go on ahead. Thank you, Clive. Uh. I'll get what was I saying? Oh yeah. So my current routine is I do like Make I train sure like three safe. days a week heavy, and so like on Wednesday I'll do. I'll do uh, press, so I'll do bench. I normally do that at home, Hold on and the then. Uh, ooh, he's right. Yeah, I normally do bench, and then, uh, and then I'll do some triceps. But when I do bench, I, I do like uh, I'll do like, I do like a warm up set. And then I'll do like a pyramid where I'll, so I'll start with, you know, 135, start with one plate. I'll do that maybe like 10 times as a warm up. Oh shit, I went the wrong fucking way, man. Uh, and then after that, I'll put on, I'll put on uh, like, like two plates. Uh, and then I'll do that maybe like three to five. 
Um, and then I'll do like 255. Uh, and I'm currently I'm doing uh, five sets, five sets of four at two at 255. Um, but if I'm trying to go for a PB, then I would do. Uh, I do like one rep at like 255, then I'd throw on like 10 or something. Um, then I'd do one more rep, and I'd basically make my way up. Like my PB right now on free on free bar is three is 300, uh, and I did one rep, so that's my current PB. Um, I haven't hit that though in like a month and a half, so I probably couldn't do it now. Well. No, I could probably do it West still. Theodore. Yeah, I could Up probably river. do it because right now I might you actually be able to do like 305. To the village, but the I'd have to train for a week though. Ether. I think just have to pray I'd have to really focus on it. I can do better than that. Toggle with me. But um, but yeah, that's what I do for. Wait, what, bro? What the? Search for Theodore up the river. Wait, what? Where is... How the fuck? Oh, I guess I... Oh. Anyway, yeah, so... And then after that, I'll just do, like, uh, some um, tricep extensions. Why do I feel like this is going to lead me nowhere? Oh, never mind. Okay, never mind. Crazy. And then for the second day, I'll normally do either deadlifts or squats. Normally deadlifts. I do a couple plate deadlifts. Um, do five sets of five on that. When I want to go heavy, though, I'll like up it to around like 275. Where are you, Theo? Um, and I'll do like maybe maybe five sets of two. I really like doing five sets of like low. Um, or I like doing like three sets of like 10. Just depends. And then I always do, I do an arm day each week. Holy fuck, there's so These creatures many. have already turned. Theodore before that dragon does. Um. Oh shit! Is this like a boss? Oh shit! Okay, it's okay. Like this thing's turned as well. This isn't going to be easy. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Wow. Bro, that thing was...
Holy shit! Holy shit! If I had to use a strength pop, man, it would have been even more. Wow. Oh my god, look at the fucking stagger! Dude, I did almost 100k, man. That was insane. 92k. It would have been 100k if I used a strength bot. Permafrost is, is broken. Per Permafrost is way too strong. That is that is absolutely absurd. That you can freeze the enemy for like fucking 7 seconds or whatever. That was insane. We have to get you out of here. Oh, f <gasps> oh no! I think it might be a little too late for that. Oh, feels bad. Bearer or no, there's only so much ether a man can take, and that Drake just wouldn't let me leave. You have my thanks. Sit. For finishing what I couldn't. Oh, that that feels bad, dude. For keeping else dream. Theodore. <laughs> yep, feels bad, man. Don't make me do this. Man, he's, he's gone, bro. Stop! Stay back, Eloise. He's turned, and so will you. Dude, get the fuck out of there! Holy shit! Why don't you just pull him out of there, man? Take care of my sister, Vito. Wait. Goodbye. Oh, oh shit. Well, that was sad. I did this? How did I do this? She needs to get the fuck out of there, man. If you skip the side quest, he would live. Oh. I, I, 
<laughs> that's fucking true, actually. Holy shit, that's so true. Thank you, Clive. I think I'll be all right now. Man, that part of the game's so pretty. That was true bravery, he showed. Leading the dragon away from the village like that. His first instinct was always to protect people. To put others' well-being before his own. And now he's gone. Because I sent him to that place against his will. It wasn't against his will. He was ready to do whatever it took to show you he could stand on his own. So that you would finally be free to live your own life. To live my own life? He never could come to terms with the choice I made. What exactly happened? You once told me Theo was the first bearer you ever helped. We grew up in Canva. We were born to one of the great trading houses. Man, that part's really, I was really pretty. chosen to inherit the family business. I had my father's head for figures, you see. Theo did not. While I studied the art of commerce, he played at soldiers instead. A late bloomer. In more ways than one. For unlike most bearers, it wasn't until his 15th summer that his powers awakened. My parents tried to drive him out of the house and into the care of the constables. But before they could, I took him into mine. Theo told me something else. He clearly admired your devotion to the cause of freeing others like him from slavery. But he said you deserved a better life than this. He wanted to free you from what he called your bonds, just as you freed him from his. I would be lying if I said I had not wondered from time to time. How much easier my life might have been if I had allowed Theo to be taken and devoted myself to the family business instead. But I have never regretted the decision I made. Being with my brother meant more to me than tradition or reputation. I only had to look at him. Now to I feel bad for doing this fucking and the quest. Choice I made, and the fact that I would make the same choice again in a heartbeat. He was never a burden. How could he even think that? If anything, I was the one who weighed him down. You weren't Eloise. He said to himself that he had always been grateful to you for saving him. And that he wanted to repay you by letting you live the life you were denied. Neither you nor Theo weighed each other down. You loved one another. You did whatever was necessary to continue living your lives together. And you always would have. You're right. All I ever wanted. All I ever did. It was so we could be together. Oh, Theo. Why did you have to... <laughs> Y'all, man, it feels bad. Dude, I shouldn't have done this fucking quest. Damn, refresh the game. I know this was a really Theo good side quest. Wanted me to move on. But I'm staying here at the Crimson Caravans to continue our work. We can make a difference here. We can help people. Save them. I need nothing more from life than that. So I'll carry on doing what we do. Ensuring that goods, people, bearers get where they need to be. Bringing smiles to people's faces, just like we always have. And to Theo's, wherever he is. This is the life I have chosen. The life I will always choose. I've made a choice of my own. You think this game's gonna to win Game of the Year? You however I can. Whenever you need it. What are the qualifications you, for Game of the Year? Let's go on together then. For Theodore. Wait, popularity? 
Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, hey, I got a. Uh, got the Chocobo sign. Okay, okay, that's cool. That's cool. Uh, wait a minute. Don't I need to do something? Oh, right. Okay, so I have to go down here. Okay, okay. Man, that was a good side quest. That was a good side quest. Ready, go. You can definitely tell in this game. You can definitely tell that this game took the Devil May Cry and Asura's Wrath. Did you guys ever play Asura's Wrath? <laughs> Bro, some of these fights, man. Some of these fights are like the, you can you can just tell, man. It's it's the same atmosphere. It's the same like over completely over the top and craziness. Oh, No, 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 Okay, okay. Okay, you wanna fight? You wanna fight, you you motherfucker? You wanna fight? You hit my fucking Jacobo, bro! Strength pop for this. Yeah, bitch. That's the only time in the game I've used a strength pot. Because <laughs> I keep forgetting about them. Alright, anyway, what were we talking about, man? Dear Strummer, Zenosis Vex, it is I, the the envoy of the Bird Council, Burge. Have you gotten any seeds today? Burge, we have given you ample warning to acquire the seeds to appease the council. Burge, Burge leave. Enough of you. Are there? Well, well. No, I don't have any seeds. I've never had any seeds. I don't eat seeds. I'm waiting. Why do people like Zelda games so much, man? It's crazy. I mean, I think they're like, I mean, well, I haven't liked the Zelda game since fucking like 64, but that's insane to me. You deserve a rest. I'm not saying it's bad. I just, I just don't get it. I just don't, I just don't get it. That's the only thing. Like the last Zelda game. Ooh, this place is cool. The last Zelda game I played was Ocarina of Time. But my favorite Zelda game was Link to the Past. Oh, no. I haven't played those. No, I'm not saying they're bad. Yeah. No, I'm just saying I don't get the appeal is all. You'll pay for this. Oh, this whole town is dead, actually. Whatever that thing is, say it's their leader. Oh. 
Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Well, didn't mean to do that. Weep. Why do I say Jacobo weird? I don't know. I've always said it that way. Should have stayed in the past. I don't think you can move in it, frozen enemies. I don't think so, no. But I couldn't move that this guy anyway because he was large. Colleagues. Oh, this is the quest. You have our thanks, stranger. Oh, yeah. Okay. Who are you? They're from that ah, secret organization, me, man. Lord. What are they called again? Oh, what the heck? Oh, a vast eth ethereal dome created by King Barnabas using the power of the icon Odin. It is not only capable of repelling assaults, both corporeal and magical, but will also consume any who might endeavor passage across its bounds. Spanning from the mining settlement of Isla in the south to Frigg's Calm to the north, the barrier effectively blocks any approach to the Waloder capital to stone here for hundreds of leagues. Hmm. Wait, Reverie. Oh, an impossibly tall tower in central Walode that seems to pierce the very heavens. The, new, the few followers of the Circle of Malleus remaining on Ash believe it to have been built by the gods who would one day pass their final judgment from its heights. It has long been considered hollowed ground whereupon mere mortals fear to tread. Ooh, the fuck is the arch? The dark ill omen skies unleashed one alt. Oh, that's just primal genesis. Okay. Arch is used only on Ash. Or the coming of cursed skies. Okay. I did not recognize you. Oh, you I'm drinking are a BCA Lord shake. Rossfield, are you not? We are archaeologians tasked with surveying this site. When the echoes appeared, our brothers here occupied their attentions. Thanks to them and to you, we were, for a mercy, able to see our duty to its conclusion. You call that a mercy? Your brothers might still be alive if you put their safety before your duty. Surely this survey wasn't worth dying for. We are charged with uncovering Ultima's origins. A duty of the highest import, as I'm sure you will agree. And you think your dead brothers would agree with you too? Holy I know they would. shit. They gave their lives for the cause, an honor to which all undying aspire. Now... <laughs> To what do we owe the honor of your presence, Lord Marquis? Cyril told me of your work here, and I agree to collect your findings in his stead. I see. That is most kind. Pray, take them then, with our humble thanks. May the Firebird's flame burn ever in your heart, as it does in ours. One thing to lay down your life for another, but for a survey, I suppose I'd better get this back to Cyril. Uh, okay. 
Ah, you are returned, my lord. I... collected your colleague's preliminary findings. Here, take them. My thanks. I shall study them, and inform you forthwith if I discover aught that might aid you in your fight against Ultima. Cyril. Your survey party suffered several losses in Kratov. Losses which could have been avoided had the others not chosen to complete their work instead of saving their friends. Were these your orders? No. This was their choice. Every Undying devotes his life to the service of the Phoenix. It is our sole duty. And should we die in discharging it, so be it. Even when death is avoidable, my lord, I fear that this is not a point over which it would be fruitful to argue. The Undying have served the Phoenix for countless generations, and your opinion of our methods, however earnest, is not like to change them. We live to serve the Phoenix. Our very order exists for that purpose, and that purpose alone. Cyril. I know that you and your brethren answer only to Joshua, but allow me to offer you a word of advice. It does not further the cause of the Phoenix to have his loyal followers surrender their lives without good reason. Provide your survey parties with an escort, that they might live to do their duty for years to come. Think not only of how you can Yeah, serve that seems Phoenix, pretty dumb, dying when you don't have Joshua to. Joshua would want you to serve him. Please. For all our sakes. I thank you for your advice, my lord. Man, he ain't taking it. If you will permit me to respond. Our faith in his grace, Joshua Rossfield, is absolute. And we of the Undying will do what we believe is right to fulfill our duty unto him. As first shield to the Phoenix, I am sure you understand what it means to do one's duty. I do. Then we are of the same mind. And it is my hope that we may continue to do our duty together. Hmm. Ice Age? What the fuck is that? Oh, is that the uppercut? Oh, I think that's the that's the blast. No. It's a movie. Be pokey, it's a movie. You're right. Uh oh my god, we're done in this area. No fucking way, bro. No fucking way. And we still have one, two, three, four areas to go. Fucking hyper poggers. Oh. Holy. <whistles> Knocking them out. Hey, man, we knew today was going to be like this, man. We knew today was going to be like this.
collect as much as I can before reinforcements arrive. Down here first? Yeah, down here first. Holy fuck! What is wrong? Wait a minute, how the fuck do I get up there? Are you kidding me? I have to go- Oh, fuck off! How do I get up there? Oh, maybe it's over here? Deserve a rest. What is this quest? Two? Search for advent spear spheres. Oh, this thing? Bull's horn. What is that? Increases lunge damage by 5%. Okay. That's an ability I'd never fucking use. There we go. I think I might have to kill this thing. Absolutely. My God, there's another one here. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. That was supposed to... No, no, no. That wasn't new. Never mind. Okay. All right. I got to pee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got to pee. I got to pee.
Should be somewhere nearby. Assuming she's still here. Uh. Just because the heavens have gone to wreck and ruin, you don't even have to. How'd I pee so fast? Well, when I get up, I just like whip my dick out and start peeing on my way to the bathroom. So that way, when I get to the bathroom, I only take like a couple seconds and then I can come back in here. Halt. Where the fuck is this person, man? It doesn't still hurt, does it? Oh, here we go. It's been a pleasure, Doris. Just like old times. I'll give your offer some thought, my lady. Don't even waste the time whip, whipping it out. Sid, what brings Prove you it. to Martha's rest? You. I heard you were out here on your own tracking our slaver. I trust you're being careful. Of course. And it had to be me. Waste. The bearers from the Dragon's Airy confirmed a long-held suspicion of mine that the slaver we've been tracking is an old acquaintance. She's no fool. If we'd come in force, she would have spotted us straight away, and then vanished without a trace. That was her just now, wasn't it? So, was it a fruitful reunion? I'd say so. She tried to recruit me. Seems her time in Rosaria is coming to an end. She's abducted bearers from across the region and is looking to smuggle them back into Sambrek. After her brush with those beastmen on the road to Northreach, she hired herself an Imperial escort, which she wants me to join. She's dangerous, Sid, but I think I can stop her. Then I'm going with you. I'll take care of the escort. You can see the bearers to safety. Where are they? The Baum Arches, soon to break camp. You go on ahead. I'll follow once I've sent word back to the hideaway. I was just about to send for you. I'd like you to take something to Sir Wade up in Eastpool. Seeds for planting. Thought it was about time they started growing their own food. I'll keep providing them with whatever they need in the meantime, of course. But if Eastpool's going to survive, it's got to be able to fend for itself. As of those Seeds. poor bearers, <laughs> they've lived their whole lives in servitude, but now they're their own masters. Small wonder they ain't got the foggiest out to provide for themselves. So it's up to us to teach them. And if you're wondering why you, well, the Wagoneers taking supplies up that way have been coming back with more and more reports of Akashic around the village of late. Sir Wade's putting a brave face on it, but I think even he's starting to worry. And if he's likely to share those concerns with anyone, it's you. Let's go. All right. Thanks. Wouldn't ask if I didn't have to. There. That should be enough to keep them in Gazal Greens for a few years at least. Got anything good from the side quest yet? Uh, so Gazal I think Greens. I can unlock a weapon. Um, Most mouth-watering crop. Blackthorn and they're hardy. Uh, Zoltan they or whatever his name is. Fill a hole. They're going to crap me a weapon. Wither away and I think frost. I got another... Or no, maybe I got that upgrade too, yesterday. Which is no small thing. 
When I say all of us need to pull together to get Eastpool back on its feet, I mean all of us. They ain't exactly succulent, but cook them right, and they're just about bearable. I'll take your word for it. Anyway, Sir Wade'll know what to do with them. And if he doesn't, I think... well, I'll go up there and show him myself. I'm sure you will. I like the NPCs in this game. They're pretty good. Um, my favorite NPC, though, was Quentin. I think. Yeah. Yeah, I think my favorite NPC was Quentin. Uh, so I need to... Uh, let's go... I need to go back over here. Wait, did I not complete this thing when I was over here? Oh, no. I thought for sure I did. Oh, shit. I wish the game was hard. The combat is for babies at the moment. A lot of weird design choices, like getting rewarded when you die. I love the combat in this game, man. Come on. I feel like people are gonna do it and say it's too easy, uh, but they're not gonna do New Game Plus. I bet New Game Plus is gonna shit all over players, man. I bet it is. I bet it's gonna just take a big old dump all over people, man. I don't know, though. We'll see. We'll see. Right. They haven't broken camp yet. Can you wear the rings in New Game Plus? And did Doris come to know a slaver, I wonder? You can't wear the rings in We've New Game Plus? Ah! Okay, She's okay. Okay. Good. <laughs> Good. We're leaving. Good. Back to civilization. You know home. what? This game is a lot like haste. 14 in the Listen, sense that, like, wit, when the normal like modes come out, this is just the normal mode story, you know? This is ready. meant to be easy. The real challenge is New Game Plus. It is. Any more, and I'll be docking your pay. Uh, yes, Mom. Oh. And unfortunately, like, people aren't going to realize that until, company. like, later, right? Kill him. You're welcome to try. <laughs> I love this trap so much. This trap might... It's definitely one of my favorite moves. My favorite move is Willow, but... Where the fuck? Okay. Fuck you, man! It's <laughs> over! I think it's a great idea, locking hard mode after normal mode. Yeah. I think it's a great idea. I think the way, so far their design choices are super, super so smart, man. Escort. Like, they make the You'll first playthrough for, for everyone. My men. I'm not the swordswoman I used to I feel be. like that people are forgetting I that surrender. this is supposed to, like... Do with me as you wish. Sid the Owl. Like, this is supposed to break Sid. the mold of Final Fantasy. You know what I mean? But because it's breaking ah, the mold, you yes. have to make things an easy I transition, it, like a smooth transition. Because, dude, if you go from, like, you know, fucking turn-based to, like, I don't know, Dark Souls or Devil May Cry, dude, that transition is, is fucking people. brutal. Better you know? For a cause than killing for coin. Like, the goal of this game sorry, is to keep Sid, Final Fantasy players, sooner. but also include new players to the franchise. This That's woman, the goal of the game. And I feel like people master, are forgetting the goal of this game. Like, children you can shit on weapons, a game in service of the highest uh, for not meeting its she goals, me like right? But I feel like if the goal of a game is met, then that's a good thing. Now, I mean, it wasn't is that a good terrible. goal? I guess that's Surely. that's that's up to you to decide. We had our fun, you know? too. 
but I would say they nailed it so far. You're always so eager to learn and had you know. such clever hands. All my other children took either to the blade or to the books. Always either or. Has it been turn based in two decades? I mean, does 15 really both. count? That's why I kept you for my own. How about it, my little dagger? Care to swear that blade to me again? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I know some I people like it. I swore my blade to you, nor will I ever. I fight for a higher cause, to liberate the bearers of this world. Farewell, master. Thank you for making me the weapon I am. You always were a righteous child. We'll react to reviews of this game Perhaps after I beat it. that's the reason I yeah. loved you so. What do you want to do with her? I am not the killer she wanted me to be. Not anymore. And she no longer has friends in high places. The dame does, though. Her connections at the Imperial watch Court the will see that review. justice is done. Yeah, we can watch some stuff. Right. If you're certain. I am. And thank you. For everything. Now, I better let these bearers know that they're safe. Yeah, that's the thing, man. People are just the, the people are just so enemies. dumb. Like they were very upfront about what this game was going to be. They were very clear. They went out of their way to be even more clear than what they should have been. And people still st still are fucking stupid about it, man. <laughs> Welcome back, Sid. Doris's message just arrived. I mean, I'm going to try to finish it today. I'm going to play another, like, the border. With any luck, they'll be 11 us hours, I think. Shortly. Or no, 10 hours. Oh, and you let her. I'm going to play another 10 hours. You don't so need to worry about Doris anymore. It. I'd been hoping as much. She mentioned one or two things in her report. So the slaver we'd been chasing all these months was her former master. <laughs> Wish I'd known. She's been arrested, by the way, over in Sambrek. Went quietly, or so we're told. And she won't be getting off lightly. The Empire may have no love for bearers, but it's none too fond of black market traders either. Can't have been easy for Doris. I'm sure it wasn't. But don't worry. She'll be all right. I hope I've so. done a lot of side quests, man. I suppose you should know, eh? You had quite the past yourself before you came here, or so I understand. Anyway, thanks again, Sid. The curse breakers would be lost without Doris. And you, of course. Keep up the good work, Cole. Hell yeah. I'm mostly doing this for the fucking rep at this point, like the Patreon stuff. Uh, oh god. Okay. Ooh, there's a new hunt. Ooh, sweet. Holy moly, there's a... Oh, wait. No, no, no. I Okay, I can turn that in. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Here, I want to go check out my blade. Go check out the blade. Do I have a plan on what to play next? Uh, nah, I'm not going to play another game next. I don't think so. Not before FanFest, because FanFest is like four weeks away. It's fucking crazy. Uh, the man himself. And then after that, it's going to we be Remnant. Just about to make a start on that sword, Remnant 2. You. I'm going to play the it's fuck funny, out of Remnant 2, man. I love that game. this would have been possible without your help. Then after Remnant 2, probably do a little bit of Final Fantasy with the you Criterion Camille, bullshit. We'll be using his level work for the grip. Um, the steel, meanwhile, will be tempered in a fire, burning the cinders you charmed out of old Solgania. And that wet stone from the Outer Isles, that'll be what gives the blade its edge. 7.0 should be announced at FanFest, yes. And the final flourish will be my talented colleagues engraving. A team effort led by oh, the hell greatest yeah, blacksmith alive. <laughs> now, now, save that talk to the things finished, yeah? Right. I'm ready if you are. To the bellows it is then. Now, I'll probably do Criterion like once and then... I don't even know if I'm going to do Savage. I might. I'll probably do it once just to do it. But, like, I don't know, man. It, I'm not, I don't think I'm going to do well, it like last time. 
I don't know. We'll we see though. We actually did it. Oh shit! Holy moly! Yo, that's sort of sick. To end all swords. Ragnarok. It's. I'm glad I did that side quest. Quite something. I uh, trust you'll take good care of it. Thank you. Both of you. So, does this make you pair the greatest craftsman alive then? <laughs> this. Nah. This was just following the footsteps of the greats of old. It'll take more than that to earn us our place in history. But we're up for the challenge. Here. A list of materials. Zoltan and I got talking on the long road back from Dravoist. We reckon with those items there. Holy we fuck! Can craft something even better than the Ragnarok. Something worthy of a legendary outlaw like yourself. That's a weapon I'd like to see. You leave this list with me. I was hoping you'd say that. One legend at a time, eh, lads? Before you start on the next, who fancies raising a cup to friendship with Peter Wynn weapon? Good idea. No more drinking to forget my past. It's about time I had something to celebrate. <laughs> then tap the kegs! Vulcan's boys are on their way! FP Pong pays to win. Goddardamarung? What the fuck? What do I owe the honor? I never thought me and Zoltan would ever speak again, let alone work together. And if it hadn't been for you... Oh, right. That's the... Yeah. Oh, is that that life. limit break accessory? <laughs> yeah. Well, and if it hadn't... I'm saying for you, dear. Ori Calcum, Dark Steel, Primitive Battle Horn. Wait, do I have the Ragnarok? I do, right? Still need Stone Tongue. And. Oh, hey, there's the Chocobo sign, yeah. Like how I just left uh, Gav with that, with that lady. <laughs> uh, Alright, so I want to do these hunts because I might be able to make that fucking weapon. I don't know what New Game Plus is. I don't know. No spoilers, don't tell me. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. I'm not there yet. I'm almost there. View the hunt board. Two S ranks? Pandemonium? And the Tricephalic Terror. Okay, hold on. All right, so let's see. 
Okay. Uh, those few souls who were able to escape from Ash before the skies change tell of Pandemonium, the king of the orcs who led his fellow beastmen in revolt against w Woloda rule. Uh, though his rebellion was swiftly crushed by King Barnabas' army, many of the orcs who now roam the twins sating their appetite for human... F okay, so the twins... Okay, what is this one? A caravan of traders traversing the Velcroy. Traversing the Velcroy. Told me of a colossal beast they had encountered on their journey. Uh, to hear them tell it, it had an aspect of a dragon. Oh, it's a chimera, a lion, and a scorpion. I contested that it might be not, but a mirage. A phantasm brought about by the desert heat. But the sweat which ran down their foreheads was cold. The Velcroy. Traversing the Velcroy. Um, okay, so the Velcroy. Uh, okay. Hold on, let's, okay. Yote. Yote. I brought back all the stone and water I could find. Will this be enough? Hide it. Hide it. Yes, the my lord. The twins wallowed Velcro. I hear my leech. No cringe. I'm sure it will serve <laughs> us until we can find another source. I'm very glad to hear it. <laughs> you and his grace are very much alike, you know. You think only of how you might help others, and never of the danger to yourselves. No more than you have, minding my brother. You've risked a lot for him, and I thank you for it. I am honored that you should say so. Mm. But I beg you, my lord, do not give too much of yourself for the sake of others. We could not afford to lose you. I'll keep that in mind. All right, that one's done. I mean, we're knocking these out, man. Uh, let's... Wow, we only got two more. There's just two more. Okay, where were they at? The twins wallowed in Velcroy. It's got to be in the desert, right? The Velcroy Desert. Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. The northern... Oh, maybe it's the northern. Holy shit, this is huge. This is huge. The Velcroy Desert is massive. Let's just finish up the side quest. Yeah, we're going to have to look for a remote spot. I heard the Guardian saying we're supposed to... Ah. Lord Rossfield, what brings you to Eastpool? A delivery from Martha. Should be easy, hopefully. Should just turn it in. Please just turn it in. These are Gizal green seats. See. Martha's keen to cut the apron strings then, is she? I jest, of course. You see, I had thought we might be able to revive the old wheat fields, but they'd long since gone to seed, only without the seeds. Martha was hoping you might be able to show the bearers how to plant and tend these, so that they'll be able to fend for themselves. That's not a bad idea. Yeah. Well, hopefully, like these bearers had only recently escaped their. Well, majority of people in here. Odin's land are like dead, or they know the blight has taken over. Of providing for themselves and their loved ones, unless we teach them how to live like free men, I fear that all we have achieved in bringing them here is to exchange one master for another. Not that myself and the Guardians have been the best example to them so far, 
subsisting almost entirely on Martha's charity as we do, it's about time we all started to provide for ourselves, bearers and guardians alike. Unfortunately, we've been a little too busy of late to focus on much besides bolstering our defenses. There have been alarming reports of... The Horde is closing in. Oh, hell yeah, some combat. They're coming, so wait, all of them. Damn it all, I thought we'd have more time. Gather the men in the square. Send to the rest for reinforcements. Yes, Sir Wade. The Horde. A Kashek, a veritable legion of them. They've been seen prowling around the northern reaches for a while now. We don't have the numbers to hold back a swarm that size. I had hoped to build a perimeter wall so that myself and the Guardians might be able to defend the village, but... Now you're out of time. Precisely. If reinforcements from the rest arrive before they do, we may just scrape through, but I fear that's rather an enormous if. What if you could call on reinforcements from Eastpool? You mean the bearers? We brought them here so they might live, not die, fighting for their lives. So wait. You said you lack men to defend the village. Are the bearers not men? Do they not wish to see Eastpool saved? Though they may not be trained soldiers ah, like probably. your guardians. I'm sure they'll use some what of the shit. Able to offer could still I would the imagine. Difference between victory and defeat. I don't know. They use, the, they use some stuff from 14. You're right, my lord. Like, maybe not I will asset one for one, but they definitely took, like, a lot of ideas from 14. I mean, some of these mobs are just literal copy-paste, just with a little better graphics, you know? My friends, I humbly beg your aid. We Guardians are we few and our rescue. enemies many. We don't need to. But I swear we, we can defeat them with you at our side. You would send us to the slaughter to serve as bait for those fiends so that you and your men might be spared. Man, I didn't even like that. And to think we trusted you. Say what you will. A home is not worth dying for. But it is worth fighting for. Oh, hell yeah. Sir Wade fights to give you lot a chance. Just like I do. Just like Sid does. We all wanted to give you a home. Yeah, where Martha's you could basically be like, free. just get your shit together. Stop being a bitch. And you got Let's one, go. Didn't you? This place, East Pool. This is your village. Your home. And if you don't fight to protect what's yours. You'll lose it. You know I'm right. This world wants to take everything from you. Everything. Your homes, your freedom, your very lives. So then, are you going to stand by and let that happen to you? Are you going to accept fate like good little Bran did and die, having never stood up for yourselves? Or will you fight like... Hell yeah, men? dude! A fucking frying pan? <laughs> I like how they carried the frying pan all the way here. What are you doing? All right. Give me a sword. Oh, hell yeah. I never dreamt I'd have a home of my own. Let her cook. Let her cook. Now that I have, I don't want to lose it. I will protect what's mine, or die trying. We all will. Free men and women, fighting together. For Eastpool! Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Thank you, Martha. Don't mention it. Just promise me one thing that you'll show them how freeborn fight. <laughs> 
gladly. Oh, I guess I don't even get through combat. They just well, did it for me. If it was numbers you were lacking, okay. you certainly won't well, be all right. now. That was easy. Thanks to you. <laughs> that was easy. Hey. Oh, I just love the sound of my own voice. Lord Rossfield, my lady, we're ready. So what's the plan of action? Oh, never mind. We'll we're getting fine. Okay, never mind. We're fighting. Never mind. Each made up of guardians, bearers, and guards from the rest. These will position themselves at strategic points around the village. Upon engaging with the Akashic, each detachment will keep the creatures occupied as best they can, steadily retreating all the while. You're going to lure them into the village? I am. We will have neither the time nor the resources to treat the wounded, so injuries must be avoided at all costs. Instead, we will focus purely on defense at first. By coordinating our withdrawal through the use of messengers drawn from among the bearers, we will aim to have the swarm converge at a point of our choosing. With luck, that point will be the village square. The perfect place for our most able warriors to surround them and fall upon them. And for you and I to finish them off. A sound plan. But one that'll require a leader with a cool head and strong nerves to coordinate the retreat. I'd say you have both in abundance to wait. But you'll be needed. Please, leave the last of the fighting to me. Ha! And let you have all the glory. Sir, wait! They're here! Then you know what you must do. We work together. Everyone playing their part. Each shielding the other that no man might fall. That Eastpool might live on. For Azaria. Yo, the kiss, dude. Oh my god. I waited 30 hours for that cutscene. <laughs> We've no time to argue, my lord. We waited 30 hours for that cutscene, not and just I will me. Do as you ask. Suppose we'd better do our bit too, then, eh? Right you are, Martha. Strummer looking extra bald today. A cute ba. I shaved my head. The calm before the storm. One of these guys. Normal trash and mobs. Here it comes. Oh, fuck me. I didn't mean to do that. All right. Okay. Uh, I didn't mean to do this, but. Uh, all right. Not let this village fall. I'm going to do that. for a boss or something. Ah, uh, maybe the boss is next. Looks like that's the last of them. Yeah. Lord Rushfield, change of plan. What is well. it? Oh, actually, oh, if anyone rest. wants the montage, the man. Curl's been sighted on Rhiannon's here's the montage. In their direction. Well, the better half of her guard is here. So wait, how many Akashic remain in East Pool? Hard to say. 
My men are still facing some resistance, but I think the worst is behind us. I could order a detachment or two to fall back and... No. Let them finish the job. You stay here too, Sir Wade. Your men need you. I'll go after the Curl. Join me only when East Pool is won. If you're sure, my lord. May the Founder protect you. one's mine. I might not know what it is. Let's go. Fly, Ambrosia. That was easy. <clears throat> nah, they haven't explained it yet. I haven't continued the main story. So if you were here last night, you haven't missed anything besides side quests. There were, there were, uh, Lord so Oswald. far, I think there were. The curl, is it? Mm, it's dead. There were three side Thank quests the worth it. There were that. three that were pretty good. And for you, my lord. But we were able to eradicate the rest of I the mean, like, this one's okay. There Our was only one really bad one. The village to keep watch for further attacks, but all seems quiet for now. I hesitate to say it, but... But, I mean, this one was I okay. I think it might be yeah, over. It was, yeah, it was all right. I think it we might. kill some shit. We did it. We saved Eastpool. Hell yeah. Thank you, my friends. Thank you. No, Sir Wade. It's us who should be thanking you. You brought us together. Showed us what it means to fight for what yeah, you Yeah, the hold blacksmith dear. side quest was cool. We never cruel. had nothing to call our own before. The Theo, or Theo died. That was, that was a good side quest. But now we do. This we one really was okay. Do. Forgive us, Sir Wade. You and your people saved us. And still we doubted you. But there's no doubt in my mind anymore. We're free men now. So we have to start acting like it. We have to fight to protect what's ours. To protect Eastpool. And we shall. We all shall. Together. This is our home. And if anyone or anything tries to take it away, they'll have us to answer to. Come on then. Let's get to the work. The cult one. Which one? Yeah, the Luber was itself. really bad. That one was really bad. It was really annoying. Like, I didn't give a fuck about that one. Which one was the cult one? Oh, the cult one. Ah, it was fast, so it didn't... Like, I, I kind of didn't care too much about it, but it, but, yeah, but at least it was fast. Anymore. The Luber one was just awful. It was no. slow, and it was 
their it was boring. Your father took pity on the bearer's plight, and I believe if he were still with us today, does the story fall off? What he would have wanted. No. I don't I think so. Might be right. The story just keeps getting better and better, man. I shall remain here, my lord, and do what I can to help rebuild the village. After all, this is my home now too, and I could hardly call myself an East Poolian if I didn't pull my weight. I think you'll find it's East Pudlian, Sir Wade. East Pudlian. <laughs> but you should be proud all the same. I'll have to pull my weight too. Can't have the rest getting outclassed. Speaking of which, I ought to be getting back. Generalize the story as white men learning mother. slavery is bad. Hmm. Of course. And I'd be counting on yours too. Us Rosarians have got to stick together, <sighs> haven't we? Indeed we have. And Clive, come by the Golden Stables when you get the chance. I ain't paid you for delivering them seeds yet. All right. I will. You always wonder how a journalist gets their job, right? I mean, I'm sure there's good journalists. Do you remember our very first mission together? But Clearing a lot of game journalists are just marshes. so fucking bad. Like, who is paying them? How like, who I is forget. paying them for that trash? I don't understand. <laughs> there's one side that I shall never forget. You, facing off against that giant marble, not a trace of fear on your face. Oh, he's remembering. Since that day, like... there have been more than a few times when I felt like giving up, when the odds oh, seemed so cool. stacked in the enemy's favor. I thought I may as well just lay down my sword and surrender. But every time I would think back to the look in your eyes that day and remember what it means to be a shield. Know that whatever trials Eastpool may face, I shall never lose courage. Thanks to you. So wait. You have always been a true shield. I know that Eastpool, and indeed all of Rosaria, will be safe in your hands. Thank you, my lord. I know the rest of the world will be safe in yours. <laughs> I'll do my best. Yeah, this was a pretty good quest. Pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good. Uh, okay, so I just go back here now. I got two hunts. I got one more quest and two hunts. This is probably just a turn in. The hero returns. I mean, it fucking better be a turn in. Lucky you came by when you did, eh? Not only did my seeds get delivered, but you went and saved Eastpool and all. I just did what I could. And it's only right that you get rewarded for it. So you take it before I change my mind. Thank you, Martha. So Eastpool's finally back on its feet again. And a home to free bearers. Who'd have thought we'd see the day, eh? Well, it was your idea. I know that, but I never stopped to think what it would mean. Bearers in charge I remember my first time in this bar, there was a fight, and I summoned a Garuda themselves. tornado inside like this bar. Like your hideaway, but not even hidden away. Though I suppose oh, the I'm rest doing are much different stream. nowadays. Oh, yeah. I'm playing through you this know, whole fucking game again. Bearers living free like that. Reminds me of when I first met Sid. Loath as I am to recall that particular day. I take it you didn't always see eye to eye. What happened? Well, if you really want to know, I started doing what I do long before I met Sid. In fact, that's how I met him. Or at least how he came to meet me. He showed up at the stables one day, asking questions about who'd been buying up bearers. Founder knows what he thought I was doing with them. Running a hunt, poking around in their innards. Something awful, anyway. Me, I thought he was a new constable. Yeah, thought special achievements. I've got a couple Somehow of those things with, with no hit. I haven't about. really been trying to do no hit runs this playthrough. I just wanted I to it, get through the. the I just wanted to get through the game. On at me about how I was doing it all wrong. I've got a couple of them, After but I haven't been able to use them work. or anything. Or is it just like an achievement? Like I it's just something. Relief, but not like you freedom. can't actually use the item. But my bearers were still dying as slaves. Got right under my skin, it did. 
told him if he didn't like it, he could bugger off and report me to the garrison. And do you know what he did? He smiled, and then he laughed. And then I did the same. We made a pact that day, that whenever one of us was in need, the other would always be there for him. And you were. Well, we both wanted the same thing. To make life better for bearers. Oh, special decoration, like yeah. your dad. Do you know, I was born right around the time Elwyn became Archduke. Growing up, I saw how he tried to change things. He certainly didn't lack for ambition, that one. Indeed. But the loftier one's ambitions, the harder they are to achieve. Which is why those of us who follow in their footsteps need to finish what people like Sid and my father started. Suppose you're right, aye. And if we don't manage it, there's always them who come after us. Good thing we've got a few half-decent sorts waiting in the wings, eh? It's almost enough to give you a little bit of hope. Hmm. <laughs> Just a little. Anyway, enough nattering. Better get back to work. Let's see about making everyone some dinner, shall we? The least the folks who saved Eastpool deserve is a hot meal. And you and me ain't gonna save the world on an empty stomach neither. That sounds like a wonderful idea. Mm. Hell yeah. Alright, we just got one more quest, guys. We got one more quest and then two hunts, two S-rank hunts. Oh, hey, we got another thing for the for the room. <laughs> oh my god, never mind. There's a quest here. <laughs> got two more quests. XFFing! XFFing! Was that shouting I heard from the barracks? Holy fuck, one more! Oh, wait, did you say I had 3k ability points? Oh! <laughs> we got deep freeze! Woo! Yeah, that's sick, dude. Got deep freeze, dude. They're gonna be frozen for like ten seconds now. That's actually absurd. Oh, Clive, what am I to do? Actually Lord, absurd. And I may soon be without a home. What's happened? The High Cardinal has descended from his lofty throne and taken up residence here in Northreach. The High Cardinal, leader of the Council of Elders. Second only to his radiance at the head of the Imperial government. Not that any of those things still exist. Now he goes by his noble title. The Duke of Oriflam. And what does he want with Northridge? He wants to transform it into a military stronghold. A foundation upon which to build a new Sambrek. He's already secured the support of the various army remnants with promises that they shall be afforded the respect they deserve in his empire. One built on the confiscated property of the people. He would rob the populace to pay for it. Believe me, I have used every means of persuasion to discourage him from this folly. But for whatever reason, he will not listen to me. What does Captain Philippe make of this? When the town was under attack, it was him the soldiers rallied around. Couldn't he use that influence again? How? By speaking out against one of the most powerful men in San Man, Black. just kill him, dude. A man whose stated aim is to revive the Empire Philippe Conrad swore to serve. One kiss, please, And to Lord. improve the soldier's lot within it. The captain can offer them a regular supply of gruel and an occasional trip to the Vale to help them forget the terrors they face each day. The Duke... TOS. ...vision of strength and safety. No. Any attempt to incite mutiny would cost Philippe the support of his men. If it did not cost him his life. But given the mood around town, mutiny may yet be unavoidable. 
The people have little appetite for further deprivation. Least of all when it serves only to elevate others. And who could blame them? Clive, would you appeal to the Duke on my behalf for your services to Northreach? You have the respect of the soldiers, and they will take you to his eminence if you ask them. And unlike Philippe, no bonds of loyalty prevent you from speaking your mind to the man. Well, will you try? You could hardly fare any worse than I did. I'll see what I can do. Thank you, Clive. Tell me then, where will I find this Duke of Oriflam? In the garrison? Overseeing the troops, yes. All right. Wish me luck. Nah, we're gonna go in there and fuck some shit up, man. I may have met this Duke before, at the remembrance ceremony. Let's hope I didn't make a impression. It's not only control of the garrison. We already have a leader in the time. Halt. Oh, sorry about that. You're the dame's man, aren't you? You got some business with the captain? No, actually. With the Duke. I was hoping I might be able to speak with him. We're under orders not to let any civilians pass. But you should be all right. His eminence has heard all about you and your heroics. Wait here. I'll go and ask. So, you are the sellsword who lent his aid to the garrison. The Empire owes Oh, I remember you this debt. guy. He's lucky he's and not I dead from all that repaid. shit, man. But tell me, is it wealth that you seek or favor? Neither, Your Eminence. I thought only to inquire about your plan to turn Northreach into a stronghold. Ah, I see. You are worried the expanded garrison will render your services redundant. Yet you needn't be. A proud fighting man like yourself shall always have a place here. Pride of place, in fact. For too long has the contribution of the noble soldier been underreckoned. But no more. For it is they who shall see the Holy Empire rebuilt, beginning right here in Northreach. Why here, Your Eminence? The town has been fortunate enough to escape largely unscathed from the recent troubles. Her defenses are sound, and her garrison well prepared. Which is more than can be said for Oriflam or Twinside. The Empire wants for a capital, and I believe Northreach to be the perfect place. With Care Norvant as her citadel. Once we have seen to the refortification of both the town and the castle, we need only build a wall around both to create a city that would be the envy of the twins. Plans are already <laughs> underway for the construction. Soon enough, these thralls shall learn that they are no match for the might of Sandbreck. I fear you underestimate how dangerous these creatures are, Your Eminence. Should they return in force, you will need all the people of Northreach to come together in defense of the town. Something they may be loath to do if they've been deprived of their worldly goods. The people will do as their leaders command. Ooh. If Sandbreck is to be rebuilt, she will require a functioning government. One whose authority is beyond question. That is why this levy is necessary. So that any man who wishes to join the army might do so and be fed, outfitted, and paid as befits a defender of the Empire. <sighs> and yet there are those who persist in peddling the treasonous lie that I seek to steal from the people and drive them from their homes. I suspect they're afraid of losing what little they have left. Precisely. 
The common folk have little and less, and you mean to deprive them of even that? You would Damn, sow the seeds of your new empire in your own salted That's earth. A loud hat. Sabine, we have discussed this. Yes, and I told you then how putting the empire before her citizens would lead only to revolt. Without an empire, there are no citizens. And in yours, there will be only beggars. Is that what Griga wills for her people? Do not take her name in vain, Sabine. I'll come back later. <laughs> the citizens revolt. I wonder what the people really think of the Duke's plan. It wouldn't hurt to ask them, I suppose. Let's begin with those on the other side of the wall. Good take. I've been hearing a lot of talk about a certain duke. Nah, it's not more side quests. It just has to talk to these three. Going around acting like oh, he owns the place. I'm a kissy. Lack of kissy. Critical. I take it you'd rather she was in charge. Jesus, man. As far man. as I'm concerned, she still is. <laughs> Thank just you. Just need his eminence to sod off Thank back you. to Oriflam. <laughs> Sell anything today? As much. Right, what the fuck is that? Uh oh. The garrison salvaged what they could. A question, if you don't mind. What do you think of the Duke of Oriflam? Mm, don't get me started. Damn. You build a life for yourself somewhere, earning for some noble to turn up and tell you you've got to hand it all over to him. If he thinks his name and his chains give him the right to empty our purses, he's in for a rude awakening. We'll do whatever it takes oh, to keep yeah. what's ours. Whatever it takes. All right there. What is it you're after, sir? Just your opinion, actually. Yo, that's a, that's true, man. The, the game isn't a flam. buggy mess. <laughs> oh, him. Not much. None of us traders do. It's Yo, I don't think we're gonna be seeing a notice. Shop this side of the wall in the first place. Uh, or, sorry, uh, I don't think we're gonna be seeing a, a tweet that says no, we apologize to, to all of our Final Fantasy fans. <laughs> If the dame said she wanted him run out of town, I'll be straight through that checkpoint. Tar well, hand. every game has one of those, you know, like the pre, like the PR the apology, the pre-typed PR. Oh my god, the the the, the pre-typed PR apology. Almost every game that comes out now has it. It's like a part of it's like a part of development. Make sure the apology's ready. You. You're the one who was talking to his eminence. On the dame's behalf, yes. I was trying to persuade him not to take the people's goodwill for granted, and but... The corporate apology. It seems my words fell on deaf ears. What do Ooh, you think game developer plans? apology tier list. I'm a soldier, mate. Ooh. He tells me what to do, not the other way around. Listen, I've got nothing That's a good idea, for the dame. Actually. That's a really good idea. But I've got a family Save that one after. for the banks. That's Remind me about that later. Lie. We'll do a we'll do a, we'll do a, a game developer tier apology. Yeah, that's good. If the Duke can get us some men, yeah, that's the really good. We need to fight off those blue-skinned bastards. I don't care how he does it. We'll get like ten of them. We'll look at like ten. We'll review like ten. I hear the Duke of Oriflam plans to turn this town into some sort of fortress. Do you think that's a good idea? It's not for me to say. All I know <laughs> is that unless the Emperor orders me otherwise, his eminence's word is law. Look, no one likes all these taxes and tariffs, but empires don't come for free. I don't know, man. This so really felt like an old feet? Final Fantasy. We all reap the benefits. Like... Um... I mean, it has side stuff. Very linear story. 
travel around the world. We already have you can choose to do the side quest if you want. You don't have to. I don't know, man. Just I thought they did a really good job so far. Obviously, I'm not the end Excuse of the game, me. Do you have a moment? I wondered if you'd mind sharing your thoughts on the Duke of Oriflam. Well, <laughs> he's made a lot of enemies coming in the way he did. Yeah, I mean, dark tide has to be one of us. You can see the state the realm's in. The traders might not like having the screws put on them. Yeah, like Captain. Thanks for the resub. volunteered a few more of their Are they gifted? Sorry, before the gifted man. Thank you guys bad. very much for all the subs. I'm sorry I'm missing like most of these. I think the Duke's got a point these. when he says rebuilding the empire is the best way of making sure we're all protected. I'm trying my best to like means, people be able to talk to you guys, but also like pay attention to what's to going on, man. It's really do. hard sometimes. Well, that's just how it goes. RPG elements non-existent. I mean, I don't know, like, I don't know what people expect, man. I mean, there's gear in this game. There's skill trees in this game. Like, I mean, that's that's RPG shit. You fucking... There's an MSQ. There's side quests. Like, I mean, what the fuck Welcome do they back. want? Like, I, like, I don't get it. Like, this is literally an RPG. I... Captain, do you have a moment? For you? Certainly. Clive, wasn't it? Thank you for last time. How can I help you? I wanted to ask you about the Duke of Oriflam. Do you intend to go along with his plan? But to tell you the truth, I can't really say the gear is I'm lackluster. Another thing is a lot of people are judging the game just based on the first the playthrough, and that's a mistake. That's not how the 14 but devs want you to judge it. This is like Philippe. tutorial mode, man. I remember you saying that you became a soldier. All of the min maxi shit, loved. like the fucking gear and the, the abilities and all that shit, that's man. Right. That's in New Game Plus. Well, the story mode isn't designed for that. Either. She thinks they could turn Northreach apart. And she's probably right. Thank you, Clive. I know what I need to do now. Protecting the people I love is what matters. Doesn't matter how. Well, duty calls, so I better go. Thanks again. I mean, I haven't, like, got all the gear, obviously, but I imagine... I imagine in New Seems Game Plus there's going to be, the like, right thing, different least. accessories that you Thanks can me. use to, like, help your build and shit. Whatever the fuck, you know, Isabel you want. will be pleased to hear that, if nothing else. I mean, you craft gear, you find gear... I mean, well, I've, I've only really found, like, one sword, but... But you craft gear, you get gear through the story. You can upgrade your gear. I mean, what oh, else can Clive. you possibly use with the gear besides, like, putting melds in it, you know? Were you able to speak with the Duke? I was, but... Yeah, you do hunts to get gear. <sighs> So Northreach is to be a fortress after I think all. what it is is people have played too many games to take advantage of it you. Will certainly help they they play too many fools. games to take advantage of your There's RNG no and your money. And I doubt it it's in their brain that that's how gear is supposed to be when it's, it's not. It's actually not supposed it. to be that. So like, I feel like people's heard, mentality is kind of ass backwards on that. New empire the Duke means to build. Sadly, his eminence values their obedience more than their opinions. And hopes to reassert the authority of the state. I fear he sees the people as mere pawns on his chessboard to be sacrificed for the greater good. Needless to say, they themselves are of a different opinion, and would rather their destinies were in your hands. The soldiers, meanwhile, are content to follow their orders. And not just because of the Duke's rank, but because of his vision. I thought as much. Had I sworn to protect Sambrek, I dare say I too would want nothing more than to see it rise from the ashes. I think we do Thank one more quest after this. Trying. But the battle is lost. I don't know about that. I mean, how is gearing in this game really any uniform? different than the other previous set? I handed it in. The other Along games. With my resignation. Told the lads I wished them well. Like in other FF games, you either got gear from treasure chest or you got it from a boss. Why? Okay, so in this one, you just craft it as you progress through the story. How's that any different than getting it from a dungeon in a, bo in a box? It, but protecting what I care about. Protecting Northreach. Like, I don't... I honestly don't, I don't understand. Those monsters will return, it's not any less creative. I'm certain they're not finished with us yet. You know? And when they do come back, we need to be ready for them. 
We need to stand together, all of us. And with you to lead us, my lady, I reckon we can do it. It was you who finally yeah. convinced me. Yeah, that's true. FF didn't even have There's gear. There's no point following orders if they go against everything you believe. Indeed. All of us standing together. That has always been North I mean, I, dude, I think this is... The, this is... which still lies within our grasp. We have only to turn our attentions to the true enemy. Like, Thank there's you so the, much customization and shit in this do. game when it comes Anything to the different you, icons lady. and stuff you can use, man. Speaking it's crazy. Of, uh, standing together, would you mind if I borrowed a few of the lads from the Vale to help keep watch around the town? I fear his eminence has loftier tasks in mind for the guard. Not at all. Be my guest. Wouldn't be the first time. I can't speak for accessories. Like, as far as gear goes, I'm not gonna... I'm holding my opinion because I expect there to be a Especially lot more accessories in like New Game Plus. To champion our cause. I, for my part, shall continue to work upon the Duke in the stubborn belief that I might still tempt him into joining hands. But I suspect I shall have to call upon your aid again. Until then, Clive. Until then. Nah, that's to be expected. Not releasing on PC. Nah, that's just... That's just... I'm not saying it's good. I'm not excusing it. Uh, but I'm saying that uh, it's just um, that's just the way things are now, man. That's just that's just the way things are. He'd have our coin. Our stock <sighs> what would my rating be on this game? So far to this point, I mean I'm biased, man. Like I mean I'm I'm really biased. Uh, because I really enjoy the story and I really enjoy the combat, man. So for me, it's like, it's at least, at bare minimum, it's... At bare minimum, it's at least like a 9.5. I don't have very many complaints with this game. There's only like two complaints I have with this game, man. I really don't have very many complaints. Like at minimum, it's like a 9.5. Like, um, I like the combat in this game just as much as Devil May Cry. Don't uh, get surrounded. I like the combat Thanks, in this Cal. game better than God of War. Not saying God of War is bad or anything, but I love the combat in God of War. See ya. But I like DMC's combat a little better, I think. Oops. Right. That's all oh, you're just a Garuda? Well, Yo, it's gonna get so much better, now. Blue. It's gonna get so much better. <laughs> I mean, I ain't gonna like spoiler or anything, but you know, it, it, it's, it's, it's gonna get way better. The amount of like different combinations that you can do with everything, man, is just so fucking cool. Wow. Okay, we're fucking done. Holy shit. We're actually fucking done with side quest. Jesus Christ. Alright, I'm gonna use the bathroom real quick.
I also think that people... Um... Oh, fuck. I think it's dumb that when a game gives accessibility to people, it gets shit on. But when a game is too hard, it gets shit on. Like, motherfuckers, what do you want? Oh, I wasn't expecting you back so Like, soon. people are so stupid. Like, if the game is too easy, then make it harder on yourself. Here's everything we've received and everything promised. You earned this. All done? Like, take a look at this and, like, I guess Elden Ring, right? Like, Elden Ring is way harder than this. Like, if you don't use the accessories. Now, I haven't played New Game Plus, right? I mean, even if you don't use the accessories, Elden Ring is still harder. But this is story mode. You know what I mean? And my point here isn't to say that harder is better. My point here is to say that Elden Ring got shit for oh, being shit. too hard, even though it was more accessible than any other Dark Souls game. Ah, Sid. Wasn't and this game so got soon? shit for being too easy. So is it good news? So it's like, what do you motherfuckers want, man? Good, thanks. You know? Yeah. <laughs> like, what do you want? Thanks a blimmin' million. I'll fit into the smelter right away. This doesn't make sense, man. Present to you the Telemon Furnace in Parishi. She's a beauty. You saved my beacon again, Sid, and I ain't about to let your good deed go unrewarded. It's it's fine, really. My bags. Yeah, I don't particularly uh, think that this that game is, is hard at all, really. You can see that, huh? I'm sure I can um, make a few improvements to it. But yeah. the combat is so fucking you could fun, just man. Buy me a bigger. I mean, I'm sure New Game Plus is going to be way stiff. harder. Reckon you could loosen it up and make some more room. And I reckon I know how. With a new alloy we've been working on, the Telemon furnace was just what we needed to perfect it. It's a metal, see? So it's lovely and strong, but it's also, well, stretchy, if you can believe it. Stretchy metal. Yeah, that's that's the thing I think a lot of people that don't play Final well, Fantasy fourteen insist, don't understand. Is, is the that the spirit. first playthrough is supposed to be the like promise. this. It's supposed to. Like if you want a challenge, then you're gonna have to do New Game Plus. And like, man. I'm just used to it. So what do you reckon? <laughs> I mean, I don't know how New Game Plus works. Actually, quite. Ingenious. I imagine all the cutscenes are still there, so you could like blast through this and then I guess watch the cutscenes later. I don't know, or just butt tough it out. I don't know, man. Reckon we'll have all kinds of uses for it around the hideaway. Can't think of any right now, but that's our job, isn't it? Dreaming up new ways to make life easier around here, maybe even out there too. One day. The whole world's gonna know about the inventions you've helped us put together. Uh -huh. That bag of yours will be the first of many. You mark my words. They'll hardly believe their eyes, I'm sure. Like my okay, okay. My only issue with the accessories is that there wouldn't be any other type of content that they were gonna put in the game to make it harder, right? But they did, so I don't give a shit what, like, I, like, as long as there's something to do, ooh, even more, as long as there's something to do in the game that adds difficulty, that you cannot use those rings for, then I'm fine with that. Like, I'm okay with that. Like, I, like, I think that's good. Like, that's what a game needs. It needs something for people who just want to go through the story, and then it needs something, something for people that want to, you know, be a little sweaty, you know? And this game, this game has both of that. How do you split? So I don't see what, like, like who, like, like how, like how can you complain if, 
if everybody wins, like I don't understand, like literally everyone's winning here. Like, <laughs> like why are we complaining? And there's no bugs. There's no day one patch, man. Like people are just so ungrateful sometimes. Holy shit, I think it's story. I think it's I think it's MSQ. Oh boy, yeah. I think it's MSQ boys. Oh S ranks. No, we got S ranks. Nope, nope, nope. Oops. Shit. Can someone oh man, does anyone know? Oh the Velcroy Desert, right? The Velcroy Desert. That's that's one of them. Oh god. I think it's gonna be up here, man. And I think the other one was in the twins. Oh my god, thank you. The Velcroy. Oh, there it is, right there. Okay, okay. All right. Yeah. Ooh, uh, hopefully, I can. Hopefully, I can enter the northern part of this from right here. Maybe. Hide it. Back to the stables, go. What? Gotta be up here, right? One of these was a chimera, and then the other we don't actually know. No use calling Ambrosia now. The orc king, right, 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 right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The orc king was the picture. The chimera was the description. It's gotta be up here, right? Looks kind of like a like a boss boss place. Bro, I can't see shit. Be oh. safe. This one's awake. Oh. Let's see what's inside. Challenge? Okay, 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 okay. 
Wow, this area is cool. Stage one, Hand of Titan. Predetermined feat of a single icon. Okay. That was actually super. Oh, that's stage one. Okay, okay, okay. How many stages they say? Three? Okay. How many stages? Ooh. Yo, these are cool, man. Wow. Dude, look at this area. These are cool. Kind of like uh, Bloody Palace a little bit. <sighs> Titanic Rampart. Uh, fully charged. I have Wind Up and Upheaval. Okay.
cancel he fucking canceled my damage on that than I should have, man. Yeah, I don't think I can heal either. Fuck. Than Fury and wind up. You're finished. You attacking that thing?
Nice. Okay. Sweet. Man, that that damage on the uh, that damage on the second stage really fucked me. Man. Oh, this is the final st Oh, wow. Okay, okay, okay. Guess there's one more. I could still die. Oh. Oh, it's an iron giant. Oh, man. This is so bad. Raging Fist and Earthen Fury. Oh, this is really bad. Holy shit. <laughs> dude, that was tough, man. Well, I, dude, the second stage fucked me, man. The second stage really fucked me. Losing that health, man. Holy moly. That was fun. That was fun, man. That was cool. Nah, that one wasn't active. Oh, oh, nice. Okay, well, this is cool and all, but where the fuck is the hint? Okay. They said the Velcroy Desert, right? There's only two parts of the Velcroy Desert. Um.
good girl. It's all the way up there. Yeah. I don't think you can check hunts outside of the hunt trial. Or sorry, outside of the hunt board. They said they encountered it. Maybe it's up there. There's some blue stuff up there. Burge or wife. You know the message. Burge, leave. You don't need to pick up the hunt from the hunt board. I guess. No, I'm not lost. I'm looking for, uh, I'm looking for the hunt. None of the stalls were planted this time. Thanks, please. Anybody know where this is? Uh, I don't know what the name of it is actually. 
I believe it's the Chimera. Christ. It's either the Orc or the Chimera. It's the Orc Captain or the Chimera. Wait, west of Main Desert. Wait, really? So it's not down here at all. Okay, so I need to go back to the Ming. Yeah, Orc is in Walud. I already know that. Yeah, yeah, it's the Chimera, yeah. Oh, south of Velcroy Desert Teleport. Okay, okay, I'll go south here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. I don't mind looking for these for a little bit, but... But after, like, I don't know, five, ten minutes, it becomes too tedious and I don't give a shit anymore. Wait, south of the Watcher. Wait, what the fuck? Oh, what? I was, I was literally right over there. Oh, I didn't see that. Right there, yeah. Straight home now. Gorgamera.
damage is going to be absolutely fucking insane. Just note, I would have done over 100k if the boss wouldn't have died. I would have done over a, Oh, there it is right there. I, I would have done over 100k if the boss wouldn't have died, but the boss didn't have as much HP. Yo, did I even get hit? Nice. All right. Uh, okay, let's go. Holy shit, MSQ, MSQ, baby. Nah, the next hunt is in this place, right? It's in the wallowed. No, it's in the wallowed, isn't it? The twins or something? I can't go there yet, can I? Or wait, where did it say that it was? Uh, oh, Wolf Dar, right, right, right. Okay, Wolf Dar, okay, okay, yeah. yeah we'll go here. This is the orc guy. Yeah, this is pandemonium. All right. Have a rest. Yeah, but he's here. Oh, shit. Right. Oh, look. It's the king of the castle. Yeah! 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 
What? Okay. Okay. Uh, I don't have any abilities. Okay. I didn't. Uh, I didn't count on that stagger. That should have been almost flawless, but I fucking... Man. So when I switched to Bahamut and started to cast that stupid fucking dumbass Mega Flare, that should have been a dodge. Which is really annoying. But eh, it's fine. I just... Ooh. Stain, stain loin. It's fine. I mean, it, it's... It's, uh, you know, just whatever. Fat finger. Besides that fuck up, though, I feel like I did pretty good. Put it on. Yeah, I'm gonna go get, uh... I'm gonna go craft that accessory now. Yeah, I think bes besides that fuck up, man. I thought, okay, so what I, what I thought was I was on Shiva. That's what I thought. I thought I was on Shiva, so that's why I hit the, uh, but I hit, but I needed, but I needed to hit, uh, my trigger one more time. So that's why I jumped into Mega Flare, and then when I saw the Bahamut's wings out, I panicked, and I was like, what the fuck am I doing? The stew's awfully thin. I would have died if I didn't have LB. Trouble with your gear, or so will it be? Okay, I still need a stone tongue. I haven't got that yet, but I can't make this. Not bad, if I do say so myself. And I can't make the sword yet. If Barnabas is can I make the, the sword? Akashic, then wherever he goes. Could I make the sword? I thought I needed. I thought I needed one more thing. And so will I. Yeah, I thought I needed one more thing. Yeah, sword is too gold and I have one, yeah, yeah.
There were only two hunts that I could have got, right? Like, I didn't see a third. Yeah, the third wasn't unlocked for me. Yet. Plague. I'm just skipping all this crap, man. This is it, boy. Damn. He said that with, like, worry in his voice. Some of the voice acting in this game is just absolutely phenomenal. It's super fucking good. Shit. Life come for you, Barnabas. Stay close, Togo. <laughs> Damn, man. Uh, yes, lightning rod does. Uh, so, yeah, so about the lightning rod, it actually has a maximum amount of hits. So it has two different... Uh, it has a maximum amount of hits and a time, like, duration, a set duration. So whichever one is reached first, then it will disappear. <sighs> Bloody fallen. Why do all their floors seem to have a mind of their own? What's the hit limit? I have no idea. It's, it's, I have no idea. <laughs>
slow. Oh my god! <laughs> Dude, the yeah. fucking dagger, bro! Insane, man. This build's crazy, dude. This, this fucking lightning rod plus gouge plus willow is absolutely insane. <laughs> absolutely fucking ridiculous, man. I didn't mean to do that. Fuck! Oh, but staggered. Toral to do anything. I wish he would have like a default AI to just use all of his abilities, like at least once. If I were Barnabas, where would I be? It's called the Ring Strong. So I could look down on the world. Oh, damn. Okay.
they weren't aggro. That's so bullshit. I don't get hit by that move. Well, that's it. Though I expect it'll fall like all the rest. Dude, this stagger's too good. Stagger's too good, man. Holy shit. Dude, this 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 build is ridiculous, man. The bosses don't even do anything. I freeze them, staggered, 80% of their health gone. They get up, staggered, then they're dead. <laughs> what was that thing? Hopefully there aren't any more. Fucking insane, man. Fucking crazy. <laughs> I cannot believe how good Willow is. That's just absolutely absurd how good that ability is, man. Watch my build not work in New Game Plus because some stupid shit where they're like, where they're like, uh, uh, where they're immune to like stagger or some shit. <laughs> oh man.
Oh, you never use Willow? I would try it. It, it. You're playing... When when you use Willow, you're playing a whole other game. You're playing a whole other game. Your entire play style ch uh, changes because you can be insanely greedy. Insanely greedy. You can just non-stop attack. I think Willow has the highest potential of damage in the game. And the reason why is because it, it, it makes you invulnerable, which allows you to do your other skills, which you would not be able to do if you didn't have Willow. Is it going to do... Um, High, high voltage? It's gonna do high voltage. Please stand there. Oh god, he's just gonna stand there? Okay. After all my fucking birds, now he does this. Great.
My god! Ugh, I hate it when I do that, man. damage dude <laughs> one of these times I'm gonna remember to use this I'm gonna remember to use a fucking strength pot and get over on okay yeah he did cheap build exquisite my liege Z G G. The fuck is that? Oh, that's Omega. I mean, uh, Ultima. Why? The blade must ever feed if her edge is to remain keen. Butcha. What care you for these worthless creatures? They are nothing. Weak from the moment of their conception, ever longing for power not theirs to command, they turn unfailingly upon themselves. Like sheep, they roam in filthy flocks, eager to trample those few gifted a fleece of gold. Or that they might feel contentment with their pitiful existence. Prejudice and persecution, severance and strife, every earthly wrong springs from the malice in men's hearts. Malice born of the pain and suffering that is free will. Its corruption is gnawed at your being from the very moment of your birth. You're wrong. It is no corruption. It is who I am. Every choice I make, right or wrong, gives me reason to carry on. And carry on I shall. Not as a puppet, but as a man. 
Which are you? <laughs> there was a time I too thought those the only choices. What? Long ago, God granted man the gift of magic. And with that gift did he build great civilizations. Yet over time, man lost sight of the gift's true meaning, stepping from the path of shared prosperity to one of avarice. He abandoned his creator for sword and flame, and through his folly, beckoned the blight. Yet, there were those few who refused to turn their eyes from the heavens, and they prayed to God that he might lead them back to righteousness. And the Lord, he did answer. Before the worthy shall the gates of paradise open, and so did I spread my arms to the ether, and cast my soul upon its gentle waters. I gave myself unto him. Proven, the Lord charged me thus. If your kind are to find salvation, they must be made to serve. You see, paradise lies but a single step away. Could we only take it? Could we only leave our transgressions behind? For none save the pure of heart and mind may set foot in the new world. I will save us. But it all begins and ends with you. You are the key, Mythos. And with this humble offering shall I prove my faith once more. So you forsook your kingdom. You forsook yourself to serve. Tell me, how is that living? <laughs> What you seek to provide is not salvation. It's anything but. Life is about always having a choice. Take that away, and we might as well be dead. Very well. Come then. Show us the strength of your will. It's not the strength of my will that should worry you. But the weakness of yours. I can freeze Odin? This guy's staggered and he's talking shit. I'm gonna be real.
That didn't do a lot of damage. Oh, I guess it's uh, I, I guess it was a cutscene thing. And you cling to this foolish notion of hope when there is none. Nah, I think he's got like story health. You know what I mean? Fuck. Oh, fuck. Finally, we can begin. Yeah. Oh shit! Wow, it actually worked? Oh! Fuck! Never mind. I could have played that second part way better. Your back on us. I needed to dodge more. On the truth, I needed to wait for my burst until we after he was done with that. As your God oh, I thought that was it. No! Oh, 
Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. Damn it. Oh, hey, it's fire sword. Oh, oh shit. shit! What? Could it be you have made a weapon of your weakness? <laughs> My apologies. Oh, you are shit. not the fool I took you for. Tell great. me you are tired, Mythos. Your stubborn defiance has stirred my long becalmed heart, filling it with a joy that I have not known for generations. Ah, oh, dude, that was so good. I had thought the tantalizing kiss of self-indulgence a dream forever out of reach. And now that its sweet ruin courses through my veins, I shall not be quick to relinquish it. Show me your work, Mythos, that I might revel in it! Wow, that is dealing a shit ton of damage.
Oh, that was so fucking sick, bro. I parried the attack and then I killed his ass. Well, the day is at an end. And we both know the truth. It is I who stand victorious. My will that prevailed. Your will? No. It was his. Clive Rossfield. Oh shit. Damn! Wigged.
Yeah, I like Bahama better, but this one was still pretty cool. This one was pretty cool. Bahamut was like one of the coolest fights I've ever seen in any game ever. <laughs> Perhaps there is strength in will. Yeah, it was just a different style. Bahamut was own. way more flashy. You relinquish nothing. What was it, if not will, that made you strive for a new world? Strive to win your master's approval? I... You were shown a fantasy, and you chose to believe it. But you were wrong. There is no world, but the one we live in. And that world, that world is worth saving, even if it means killing a god. Dude, take the power. Oh, Barnabas is going to give him the power. Words. From one who has served the Lord so well. This is pointless. <sighs> but I almost forgot. <laughs> I promised that I would make you presentable. Did I not? <sighs> Fulfill our destinies just as the Lord's Malu crystals have fulfilled theirs. Come, Clive Rossfield, take what is rightfully yours. Become one with God. No. Oh, damn. Yo, he ain't looking too good. At long last, salvation. I'm coming home. Mother. <sighs> He's dead. to the divine. With or without a will, you are still but a vessel, our vessel. Behold, how your body shudders in anticipation of its fate. It's not yours yet. No. Come then, O oh wayward child. We shall await you upon the back of the first worm. There all shall end and begin again. Where the fuck is that? It's like quest time. 
first worm. Leviathan? A lost? Leviathan, a worm? Before or after Dark Souls. And then you turn up. What the hell are you doing here anyway? What indeed? <laughs> the enemy numbers 200,000 or more counting the orcs. There are simply not enough soldiers counting in the capital to repel an army of that size. Then one of the central keep. Held by a contingent of soldiers and bearers from the surrounding forest. They are the sole reason it still stands. And all it took was an army on their doorstep to bring them together. The prospect of death does put things into perspective. <laughs> I thought perspective. Odin was cool, but he was... All along. Um... His fight definitely wasn't better than Bahamut. I liked his fight. It wasn't as cool, but um... Actually, my favorite parts of Odin were before the fight. He was crazy, though. I mean, he was a he was a pretty good villain for being like just crazy. But my favorite part of his, I guess, his character was how like menacing he was. Oh no, his fight wasn't near, near, near as good as Titan. Now, his his fight was kind of mid. Yeah, it was pretty mid. But everything outside of the fight was really cool. I like the area you fought him in a lot. And you and here of the same mind. for the opposite. Like basically they built his character up a lot to be Omega powerful. So they should have Bahamut's fight definitely felt more epic. Like, for how much they built his fight up, like, for how, like, terrifying that he was in, in the cutscenes and stuff, this fight didn't portray that. Then mayhap they are the wrong men. Oh, hell yeah, let's go. Dion's back, let's go. Our numbers are few. But I shall rally as many of my dragoons as I'm able. You, apprise the Lord Strategist of the state of the city's defenses. Yes, Your Radiance. And you would fight alongside us. I owe the Phoenix a debt. Yeah, there wasn't really an icon fight between the two either. <laughs> Does this vouch for my nephews? Aye, but His I still fight have my was... About yes. Which we can discuss later. Indeed. You said you I don't know, is this fight better than Garuda's? Keep. I don't even think his fight Captain, was better than Garuda's. Do you know how many yet remain? Allow me to confirm. Commander? Whatever their number... Nah, Titan's Randall fight was definitely be better than his. Oh. ...and build a pyre in the courtyard. Quickly. 
Yeah, I think Terrorist. actually I think Odin's was My probably the worst. Actually. You will find a girl there. A girl. We are in the middle of a war. I owe her my life. And I always pay my debts. You are to see that she is provided for. Dion, I cannot leave. But you shall. If I'm ever to be worthy Yo, he's of still alive. Of our what was people, his name? Terrence? Then I must earn it. Or Terrace? Or wait, what was his fucking name? And I must earn it by my hand. And my hand. Yeah, Sir Terrence. Okay, that's what I thought. No, that I do not ask this lightly. And know that I will do it. Farewell, Terrence. Dion's cooking faster than Clive. <laughs> no, they already kissed. It's fine. It's fine. He, yeah, dude. He, guys, he cooked at the start. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, they yeah, they kissed at the start. Guy, okay, okay. All right. Guys, look, man. Look, look. D look, Dion already cooked, all right? He already cooked. Okay, you guys are late to the party, all right? <laughs> yeah, the motherfucker served dinner like 2 days ago, bro. <laughs> like, you're like 2 days late to this shit. <laughs> No kisses, just like chat. No kisses. Thank you. Reported. TOS. Reported. Clive, Wigged. Thank fuck. You're Bam. right. I am. The coolest part of Odin but I'm a damn was when he cut the sea in half and you fought him down there. Barnabas. That was the most epic of Odin's I interactions, I think. Because that, that, part, that part was badass, man. That part was probably when he was like the scariest. Either that or you know what? Now, nah, you know another like super, super awesome part that was subtle was when they were in the town and Gav had this like, had this like shocked look on his face and he was like looking up at Odin but Clive didn't know and we didn't know and then Clive looked at him and then like looked up and then he had a shocked look and then it went to him dude that was so fucking badass Yeah, that was pretty... Yeah, like, man. So I guess Odin was way cooler, like, in the cutscenes, right? Like, Odin was way more badass in the cutscenes, but his fight was, like... I don't know. It was, like, mid. Very mid. Yeah. Gav, we need to talk.
I'm sorry, Clive. You know I want nothing more than to go with you. I do. But I'm glad you're heading back to the Enterprise nonetheless. And not just for Edda's sake. Our people need to know what happened here. You can count on me. As can she, I hope. Thank you, me lords. Is Gav cooking? I think Gav's cooking, dude. Do you think that was wise? Wiser than leaving a woman with child alone in the Deadlands. They'll be safer at the hideaway. For now, at least. Isla. What actually happened, guys, is because I took so long doing the side quest, Gav and, and, and her raised the baby, then Gav and her had another baby, and that's Gav's baby. Is over with Akashic. <laughs> the king himself was long turned. We'll be here by choice. All to serve Ultima in his damnable quest to forge the perfect vessel. The chaos Barnabas wreaked upon nation after nation. How many were killed for this? Ah. Oh, he didn't consider it killing. Or a mercy of sorts. A way to end their suffering. He truly wanted to save mankind, and ultimately use that. As he uses us. Oh, wow, that's deep, actually. But why us? So Ultima took advantage we? of him, I, yeah. What are we? Huh. We are dominance. That is our fate. But that doesn't mean we have to accept it, which is why we fight. For the right to deny it, is that not? So, it is for our sins. Barnabas said something else. That the mother crystals were Ultimas. Ultimas? Are you certain? We know that the mother crystals have been leading the land of Ether. We also know that it's this which hastens the spread of the blight. But what I cannot fathom is what Ultima stands to gain from that. What did you find at the stronghold? The truth about Ultima's prize. For so long, I believed it to be you and you alone. Yet, it is not merely a freet that he desires, but a freet and phoenix both, that which we became in the skies over Twinside. Only when the twin flames are joined shall his vessel be complete. Quite why he needs a vessel is another question, unless there is something he cannot achieve without one. Something his immaterial form precludes. Something requiring an unthinkable amount of ether and a body resilient enough to channel it. If I did not know better, brother, I would think that he meant to cast a spell. A spell a thousand years in the making. A spell to end all spells. But he cannot do it without us. Nor without the Mother Crystals. But if we destroy them all, we will stop not only the Blight, 
But Altimer as well. Gonna cast Altima, classic. <laughs> we stick to the plan then. <laughs> this time. We face him together. Well, it's a long walk to stone here. Let's not keep Ultima waiting. <sighs> Brotherhood. Power of Darkness. Um, Clive's magical spells, but also, okay. Gungnir. Oh. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay, that's cool. All right. Okay, sorry guys. I've had to pee for the past five minutes. We'll look at the thing when I... Okay, holy moly, man. All right. I'm sorry, man. I was holding in a I was holding in a piss for like 30 minutes. Odin channeled. Ooh. Okay, let's see. All right, Arm of Darkness. Individual attacks with the Odin's blade are far less potent than those with Clive's regular weapon. Uh, okay, pressing square immediately following a precision dodge while the arm of darkness is active will result in a powerful attack called Flash of Steel. Oh, pressing square after a successful parry. Steel counter. Using both Flash of Steel. Okay. Oh. Okay. Gungnir. Oh, holy fuck. Jesus, man. Okay. Oh, wow, you can use it in air, too. Follow-up. Landing hits fills the Zanditsukin gauge. Oh. Okay, pressing X while wielding Gungnir lifts the enemies. But renders them vulnerable to follow up. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. Surge forward to strike an enemy can be executed multiple times in succession. If the first strike hits, okay.
Using while executing another ability will temporarily slow time. Reduced rift slip cooldown by 50%. Okay, I wish it would tell me the cooldowns. Okay. Dancing steel. Hmm. Okay. Um, That's crazy. Uh, okay, so, uh... Alright, well, I'm definitely getting rid of this. Um... Okay... Oh, fuck! I can't. I'll lose, uh... Ooh... Um, well, I could rip, I mean, I could rip, I could replace. If I have max level of, um, I can see how much damage it does. Okay, let me see how much damage this does. Uh, okay, Rift Slip. Um, this might be good, but the problem is I don't have space for it. Dancing Steel. Um, wow, the damage is shit. Oh, I see. Okay, okay, okay. All right, I understand now. This is why the damage on this is so low. Is because, yeah, because the damage on this is so high. Um. Hmm. Dude, that animation is insane. Uh, we'll just try this. We'll try this. Oh He's my magic. fucking god, are you kidding me? Um... Nah, it's just one. It's just one. It's not... Okay. Uh, Alright, so... Just reading these abilities, I don't think I'm going to use any of these, actually. Um, this is just not going to work for what I'm trying to do. I'm not saying that they're bad. I'm just saying that I don't think I can use any of these, but I'm going to try them anyway. Uh, I'm just trying them on trash. Um... So, basically, uh, I don't think I want this. I think I want the other one. I think I want, I want, what's, man, I really wish it would tell you that cooldown on these abilities, man. Like, 
I, I really wish it would tell you the cooldown. Well, the thing about, okay, so here's, so like, here's the thing. Like, I mean, that seems to be filling pretty fast. I want to use Gungnir. Here's another thing, though. Like, I need to get rid of... Fuck, man. I have, like, no ability points at all. Because I had to sack it all into that. Fuck, man. Is there anything else I'm not using that I could... I'm still using that. I mean, I could get rid of permafrost. I mean, well, not get rid of it, but I could just downgrade it. Yeah, you know, I could downgrade it for now. Um, I need to. Hmm, let me think. I'll upgrade this. Um. I'll swap this out for Holy shit, that's pretty cool. Swap this out for Heaven's Cloud. Okay, so basically I'm gonna have these three and I'll do ooh. Um Okay, let's try this. Let's try this because you know what? There it is. I want Giga Flare more than I want whatever the other one. Uh, the judgment bolt. Okay, so shit. Hold on, sorry guys. I, I have to think about what I want to do here. So this is basically gonna replace this is gonna replace ignition. Uh I, I basically gain a move, actually. I gain a move because I was never using Bahamut's ability, but now I have this to use. Uh, so, okay, so let's try this setup. Yeah, let's try this and see what happens. Oh, you have to have Odin on. Wait, really? Oh, that's true. Okay, okay, okay. Right, right, right. Ooh, okay. Uh, then that case, um, that case, it's okay. Uh, I will. I'll remove the. Ooh, man, my fucking. Man, my commands are gonna be all over the place. This is unfortunate.
Man, I'd really like to upgrade this. I just need to test them, man. I just need to... It's barred to us no longer. I just need to test them. Joshua. Time to do side quest, my lord. But he's up ahead. Oh shit. That's actually a fucking guy here. Alright. Is there no peace for a dying man? What happened here? The ether floods made savage priests of my companions. And those faithless orcs, I knew. They yeah, that's what I was looking at dancing. We were told dancing steel. The day would it looked like it stopped time. Cause. Something commanded their loyalty, but it was not us. It's a wonder they stayed faithful for so long. I think dancing, they depending downfall. on the cooldown, dancing steel might the replace gouge. Gone. Our nation in ruins. <laughs> what becomes of us? Well, loyal no. Pawns mm. now. Sworn to a shattered mm. throne. I'll see. Yeah, gouge Fuck is still better. <laughs> Fuck the dead king and his god. <laughs> Giga Flare Fuck kind of stops time, yeah. Hole. Yeah, this whole build, th th this whole thing just you. depends on how much damage Zandatsukan does. If Zandatsukan is in his, his, lost his brand. Pray, hear me, brother. even if Zandatsukan is as strong as Bahamut's, it's not going to be enough. Zandatsukan has to be stronger than Bahamut for it to Will even be worth it. For what I'm trying to do. To rest? Of course. What do you need? Yeah, I'm going to test it. Oh, finally. Some luck. I'll go test it. Yeah, well, I'll test it on a boss. Walls. Towards stone here. There is a forest. Never turn. My parents are No, I don't think I can replace Gouge. Nestled amongst the trees. Theirs was the only love I ever knew. I was torn from them in life. But Dude, this random wounded guy here, man. This is crazy, because it's like... Ring. This place is completely fucking abandoned. See that it rests beside their bones. May you find peace at last. Yeah, that's the thing. Gouge is good on its own. Gungnir needs other skills. Yeah. Yeah, this entire thing is dependent on how... Am I going to run into an Aetherite soon? I'm probably going to run into an Aetherite. I, I, I don't want to go back until I run into an Aetherite. Well, where's the... Eh, fuck it. I'll just go back. It's fine. I'll just go back. I, I can just run back up here. It's fine. Alright, let's go. Oh, new hunt. Uh, 
okay. <sighs> yeah, let's go. We're just gonna have this guy sit here for a second, man. Uh, enemy aggro. Okay, so... I can already tell you right now that this is... This is gonna be less damage. We'll see, we'll see. Let me get level five, let me get level five. Okay. How do you do it, you old square? Hold square, okay. All right, so... Okay, at least I keep my charge. Okay, so that's good. That's good that I keep my charge. Uh, okay, so... Jesus, uh, this is gonna be really awkward. So, willow into trap. Willow into trap. Into the gun there. Willow. Ah, I forgot I had that, that stupid sword equipped. Ah, that's annoying. Okay, okay, okay. Let's, uh, let's, here, let's fucking do this. Yeah, right, 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 okay. Uh, let's... Okay, how... That was like 20k damage? Here's another thing though, guys, is look how little damage this does. You have to remember that like, look at, look how little damage this does. So while I'm sitting here fucking around, it's not though. I don't think it's better than Judgment Bolt. Like you guys, you guys aren't, like you guys are just looking at the end number, the, the very end result. You're not looking at what it takes to get to that result. What it takes to get Zanditsuken up this high is you have to do this shit. I guess you can dodge too. I guess you can dodge too. So we'll try the dodge. Here, yeah, we're gonna try this now. Okay, so basically I'm just gonna gouge him down. Gouge him down. Okay. Alright, so... Let's... Okay, so... Willow, Trap, Gungnir, Mega Flare. Okay. Those. 
Okay, okay, 100, 100k, 100k, all right, all right. Um, how much damage did it actually do? Did anyone happen to see? It did 23k. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Uh... Okay, that was a lot of damage. Um, let me reset enemy aggro. Okay. Let me try with LB. So... That's kind of shit. The game, I mean. I mean the game. I mean, it looks fucking awesome. I'm just gonna reset it. That, that's not the way. Gungnir is not the way. That takes way too fucking long and does zero damage. I could have done more damage than 100k. Let's try it again. Yeah, you don't do Gungnir there. You would do... Wake and win! What's the other one? Is that a timing thing? Okay. Wow, that really fills it. Okay.
22k. I didn't do LB. I don't know. No, I'm trying to see what it would do like without LB. Uh, so it would be. I guess I would have to be gun mirror. It's very awkward to switch. Oh, I don't have... Oh, my God, dude. Fuck off. Fuck off. Ugh. That was a stupid bar. Ugh. This is, like, so reliant on this shit, man. This is so reliant. Actually, the stagger on that wasn't too bad, but I did spam it five times. We're gonna do this. Uh, we will do... I don't think I'm gonna get it. Maybe. Fuck! That move's really good. Yeah, no, yeah, that yeah, that move is really good. Okay. I'm gonna LB later into the cast, actually. I have to, kind of. I wouldn't have this again, I just want to do it just to see. I wouldn't have it again though. <laughs> I just wanted to see. Nah, I wouldn't have it there. Okay, we're gonna try, we're gonna try. Um, I'm gonna take off Gungnir, I don't like Gungnir. It's way too long, man. We're gonna try... Fuck off. Um... Garuda! Yeah. 
Okay. Jesus. Okay, my question is... Okay, hold on. So let's see. Yeah, we're gonna see. We're gonna see. Oh my, it took off my, it, ah, god damn it, that's obnoxious. I wonder what the cooldown on this move is. LB that would have been like 120k or something. Okay, so that's pretty good. That's pretty good. Alright, let's try with LB. Let's try with LB. That move is actually that move's actually horrible for LB because it doesn't slow down LB's time. Could be over 100k, yeah. Okay. Almost killed him. Alright, I'm gonna try it again. But I'm gonna use LB after I use the thing. And it should I should kill him in one. I should kill him in one. I'm not gonna get two damage tokens. No, there ain't no fucking way, man. I mean I highly doubt it. I mean I I could try, maybe. I might get it. I could try. It's not gonna be but I have to sacrifice Mega Flare, is the thing. I mean, I could try. Bro, 
when I hit fucking circles. Jesus Christ, man. my current setup my current setup is uh man I really wish I could get like I really wish I could have uh loadouts man uh, this is Zanitsukin is definitely stronger than Judgment Bolt. Um, hmm. 
Yeah, Zanatsukin's definitely stronger than Judgment Bolt. It's probably stronger than this, too. I don't know. It's hard to tell without a... Like, it's it's hard to tell with all the hits. But enable to make Zanatsukin work, you have to use all of this shit. Hmm... I, I'm trying to figure out how to, like, put it in my build, but... Okay, so the problem is, is, like, Zanatsukin's stronger. Like, Zanatsukin is stronger than this. Like, yeah, I mean, it, it, it's... So I did, like, 100. I did. I, I have no idea how I did the 120k. Oh, I did the 120k because I cheated, right? Okay. All right, well, that one doesn't count. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> So, so Zanatsukin's definitely stronger than this, and it's either as strong or stronger than Giga Flare. Um, but the problem is I have to sacrifice at least two moves. Uh, my stagger is going to be... Hmm... Man, I really wish you could charge. I really wish you could charge that shit without being on Odin. So if I get rid of Ignition and I get rid of Judgment Bolt... Which two do I want? I want this one for sure. Dancing Steel. Dancing Steel and probably uh, not Gungnir, but this one. Hmm. Fuck, man. I don't know, dude. Let me do an actual fight against this guy. Ah! <laughs> 
That was a lot of damage. All right, let's try this. Yeah, let's try this. Let's yeah, let's try this shit. Okay. Yeah, let's try this shit. I don't need to upgrade. Oh, wait, hold on. Wait a minute. Yeah, hold on. Where's Heaven's Cloud? Okay. All right, Heaven's Cloud. Lightning Rod. Why do I feel like I'm missing something? Oh, you know what? I gain extra points because I'm replacing Zanditsukin with Judgment Bolt. Okay, okay. Okay. Or, I mean, uh, Judgment Bolt with Zanditsukin. Okay, okay, okay. Um, just out of curiosity, I want to see what this guy does. Maybe it's good. Maybe it's good, but I don't want to overwhelm myself. I'm not trying to think about that right now. Okay. All right. Let's just. You know what? Okay. Let's let's not let's not overwhelm. Let's not overwhelm ourselves. Let's do this for now. Let's do this for now. And, uh, <clears throat> we'll just try to get good with this. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not saying that the Rift's shit is bad, okay? I'm not saying that at all. I'm saying that right now my, my brain is, is a bit, is a bit over overwhelmed because I have to, basically all of my muscle memory keybinds are like fuck, so you it know. Be. Ooh, holy shit! Ever dark. Oh, but it sucks. It's not as good as Ragnarok. I mean, should I just make it to make it? Yo, that's cool, man. A side quest. A side quest item. Not bad. If I do say so myself. No, I can't upgrade it. I mean, that's cool, though. A side quest item is not as... Oh, Anything shit. I else? fucking equipped it. Fuck. Yeah, I'm gonna do the hunt now. Covered in nicks and lumps, the lot of them. Someone made an assy of FPP Pong. Jills. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh, dude, okay. Holy fuck, okay. Eastla? Load. Uh, what in the world? Um, fucking weird. Okay, anyway. Uh... Critten Hollow. Critten Hollow. Willowed. Uh, 
load. Dude, all of these are in the load. Twin Titan's Wake. Hide it. Hide it. Man, you guys are so stupid. Literally fucking your children. Uh, let me see. Hmm, what is it again? <sighs> Titans Wake Dalmechia? Oh, that's so great. Great. Okay. Uh, Dalmechia. So Titan's Wake. Titan's Wake. Ooh, okay. So it's here. Knock this one out. No cringe. No cringe. Let's go. Did you just up enter? No. I just banned you. Truth equals ban in the stream. Truth equals ban. Get the fuck out of here. No need to ride from here. Oops. Good girl. Fly, Ambrosia. the rest. Straight home now. Oh, it's another one of these. Arena of Demolitions. Wow, the hunt really isn't here. Holy fuck, Silver. I know, bro. Calm your tits, man. I know. I've seen you at me like five times, man. It's okay. I was just building up stagger to build up the... I was just building up the bar to build up the bar. <laughs> I am aware. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Is 
Is there another Titans? What? How far does Titans... Oh, maybe it stretches over here. Fly, Ambrosia. Yeah, maybe a good call. I'm probably gonna fuck these next few battles up, man. Uh, because my keybinds and my shortcuts are all fucked up, man, like from what I'm used to, you know? Alright, well, it's... I mean, I would imagine it has to be somewhere around here, right? Bro, where is this? Where is this mob? Does anyone know where this mob I don't even think I'm in the same... <sighs> yeah, this isn't even... Where was it again? Titan's Wake. Okay, so here's Titan's Wake. I checked all around here. Hide it, hide it. Probably gonna fuck this up. I don't know your friends out there. If it's me you want, I'm right here. Oh god, I already fucked it up. Yeah, we're shooting lasers at each other, man. God.
fuck, man. Sorry, sorry, I had to do it, I had to do it. And don't come back. <sighs> okay, this is a big shift in mentality, man, from what I'm used to. So cool, my king, so cool. <laughs> okay, it's gonna take, man, uh, I'm sorry, I'm probably gonna, wait, the crocs. It's, man, it's, it's probably gonna take me a little while to get used to this. I, I'm gonna be honest, man, I, I don't know if I like it or not. The Croc. The Croc. What the fuck? The Croc. Uh. What the fuck is a croc? Oh, here's the croc. Okay. All right, nice. Right, let's go. Let's go the croc, boys. <sighs> yeah, this is really disorienting for me, man. This is like... Ready, go? Mm. Very, very disorienting.
Oh, this is where I fought the Drake. Yeah, there's this big dragon that I fought here before. This frog, yeah, yeah, I already killed him. Yeah, I beat his ass, man. It was a cool fight. Straight home now. And then all the rest of the hunts are in the load. This is hard. Sweet dreams. Not the boss, but trying to relearn all these keybinds, man. This is fucking hard, man. This is really awkward. Okay. I honestly think that the I think my other build was better, man. I'm not gonna lie. Like, man, I think. Like, this is cool, though. I mean, Zanitsukun's cool, but... I'll keep using it. The thing is, is, like, I think the high end of this is better. The high end of this is better, but, man, it just... There's so much setup, and if anything goes wrong, it's just... It's a fucking huge damage loss. Like, both of those staggers could have been, like, 90k... And both of them were like, I don't know, I think one of them was like 70, another was like 60 or something, man. You know what I'm saying? I feel like my stagger damage was way more consistent and way more 
But it also could be skill issue too, right? Like I'm getting used to the, I'm, you know, I'm getting used to the, um, to the new keybinds and stuff. I'll mess, I'll like, I'll use it a little more. I'll use it a little more before I switch back. I, I do think I, I want to switch back though, but, but, uh, I actually need to go back and buy supplies. Let me tell you a story. Oh Five. my god, I just right. want to buy some... Them rumors <sighs> wet legs were spreading. Might be they weren't just tails plucked out of thin air. This is isn't a even a quest, I bro. Particular about Holy shit. Too, so long as they paid me the right price. Some women lust after blood, others after flesh, but me... I would always want for Yeah, but I feel bad if I had... And to satisfy that lust, I sold to opposing Wet legs armies, were spread. Stabbed my every client in the back. Made myself the most hated woman in the twins. But then one day... One day I met a man who made me a different kind of offer. Said he'd give me access to a realm-wide community of like-minded individuals in constant need of steel and sundries. On the condition I sold to him and his alone. Was that the first time you met Sid? Aye. And I fell right into his damn trap. He was true to his word, so I ended up being true to mine. And I soon started making the best profits I've seen since taking up the trade. Oh, hey, what's up, And all up, without aiding or abetting any outlaws. Except Sid himself, that Has is. Has it really been that long? Fuck, dude. Told me about his plan to topple the mother crystals, you know. Said that with them gone, the realm would want for all manner of things. An opportunity for the likes of me to mint guilt. Dude, I just wanted to buy an yeah, item, I man. Fuck. I just should have bought an item from somewhere else, man. And that's when he had me. I emptied my stores that day and moved into the hideaway proper. And the rest, as they say, is ancient bloody history. A dozen years on? And I'm still not the richest damn. I mean, I like this character, but I just wasn't like in the mood for a mind. fucking cutscene. But I can say that I have never been happier. You've all shown me there are some things more precious than Gil. That there are. So don't you go messing it all up. Or you'll have me to answer to. I mean, she is kind of brutal, dude. She cut out this guy's eye. It's a dangerous world out there. You're rubbing me blind, you know. It'd better all be here. Wow. Okay. You'll not find a better price than that. All right, so the rest of these are in. We'll load. Critten Hollow and. Okay, here's this. Okay. Edge of Infinity. Bruh. You're so stupid. You guys are so dumb. The the thing is, is like you think that you you think it's funny too. You think it's so funny. Like you think you think that you're like fucking king of comedy.
Oh god. Dude, I don't know where this fucking guy is, man. Ready, go? Run like the wind. Nah, I don't think this is it. I don't think over here. This is this is the angry gap. This isn't I think I gotta go back. Yeah, I think I gotta go back, man. Might be in this town. Um yeah, it might be in this town actually. Maybe this is the goblin? This one sucks. Okay, that was pretty fucking cool, though. Holy shit. Okay, that was pretty fucking cool. It's <laughs> like a body just ragged all down from the heavens, bro. <laughs> that hunt was shitty, man. All right. Uh, Crit and Hollow, half... Half comb, Critten Hollow, half comb. Okay, here's half comb. Where's old Critten Hollow? I guess I'm going down here.
Master. Caution, brother. Something there. I can feel it. But now's not the time. Now, this is a linear path. There's no way that I miss this guy, right? Straight home now. That was good.
I already don't like this build because of the smear bow. Man, that, that's a cool move, though. That's a cool move, dude. Think of more shit to say. I'm gonna say something really badass after every Zandasukan. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You just wait and see. I'm cooking. Oh, I'm cooking. Good God. <laughs> oh, I'm cooking. New RP unlocked. No cringe. Please. I don't. Oh god. Who let him cook? Fuck me. Oh, okay. So I need to go up. Oh, right, right, right. Okay. Where was the last one? Uh, have come, so I need Crit and Hollow. <sighs> Crit and Hollow. Yeah, I think the other build does more damage. More consistent damage. I want to try to get 100k with this, and I'm probably going to switch back. No use calling Ambrosia now. Same build. Same hair, same shirt, same bulb. <laughs> Man, I got to order some food now. soon, guys. You're getting hungry. Where's Kissy's Fly Ambrosia band? to the capital is through that gate just as you surmise there's an army down there Joshua yes but I don't see any dominance I deal with no damage. Baruda! Okay.
I mean, it looks cool, but... I just, I literally used my Zen so good too. I literally just fucking used it. And there's a, there's, there's a fucking big guy, of course. Of course. Joshua, this one's bigger than the others. And Nina, by the look of it. Fucking got his ass, dude. Holy shit. That's sick. That's sick, dude. I got a mid teleport.
through the darkness I came, meeting you, bringing agony, misery, my Zendetsuken. All shall fall. We can rest here if you like. Don't worry, I'll be fine. That was incredible. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, all the all the vods will be on YouTube. Also Twitch too. Look, Clive. Do another one. <laughs> I'd have found that. The place is a fortress. Uh Yo, you guys gonna hate me if I switch back to my other build? I think I'm gonna switch back. Yeah. I think this is really fun. This is this is cool, but it just eh, it's just too much setup, man. Plus with this, um, I don't get to freeze the enemy as much either. I'm not saying that was bad. I think this is, I think, I think this tree is pretty good. This is a pretty good tree. Crazy, man. My favorite move is still Willow. <laughs> still my favorite move. <laughs> Crazy, man. Bodies. One could almost believe the whole kingdom had turned to Kashik. Yo, this is actually pretty sick. Alright, so we gotta find the hunt. There's a hunt here. Mm, yeah, you're probably right. It's it probably is better than Bahamut than have like the Bahamut ability is really bad. Like I'd rather just have Xandas who can be available. But the problem is I don't have I don't have that many skill points is the issue. Like I can't master both the Thunderbolt and or sorry Judgment Bolt and uh, the um, the other thing. Like eventually, yeah, eventually I want to get the fuck off Bahamut. I think the Bahamut tree is dog shit. I think it's really bad. I don't really care for Mega Flare very much. I would rather, like, randomly have the option of a Zanditsuken, right? Like, let's say I get one Zanditsuken off once per fight. That's still better. That's still better than Bahamut, whereas I have nothing. I never use that ability. Dude, I just want to find this fucking hunt. Does anyone know where this hunt is?
I don't know. Might be in the field, yeah. Ooh, what's over here? That's gotta be it. won't be very much damage. Oh, that sucks.
I fucked up like three dodges, man. That was bad. That's all right. I got a couple good freezes though. Let's hope it was the last of its kind. Come on, fly, Ambrosia. Probably be on for another like five, five and a half. I'm gonna try to beat the game today if I can. What? Yeah, I did every single side quest, man. As fine a resting place as any man could hope for. Reunited with those he loves at last. I notice we have been missing a severe lack of kisses today. Is it because you hate chat now? Did we say something mean? Are you and Lil Zeems having issues? Please respond soon as I could really use a kissy right about now. Thank you. Oh, that's cool, man. Does it bother you that we haven't heard a single human sound? <laughs> Everything about this place bothers me. before the storm there's only one way into that city across the bridge through the main gate right into the midst of whatever is left of the late king's army are you ready for this as ready as I'll ever be
This looks like the first um, crystalline city that got taken over by like the blight. What the shit. hell happened here? I dare not think. A stroke of good fortune, perhaps. Oh, maybe not. Oh no. I hope you're right. So do I. I'll go back. Oh, I can't. Oh, yeah, okay. I can. I just want to get upgrades. That is a huge fucking upgrade. Is there any way I can get Oricalcum? Or Darksteel? Oh, I can make that. Maybe I'll waste it on other stuff. Nah, it's alright. It's whatever. Good fortune, perhaps. I hope you're right. So do I. This is a boss arena or anything. Oh, what? That's a bay. 
behemoth. Who would be mad enough to tame such a beast? Oh my god! I got chills!
fuck off, man. I didn't mean to. Fuck. Fucking dead. It's not dead. It's not. Dead. What the fuck? How is it not dead? It's got zero HP. What do you mean, meteor? What the fuck is this shit? Extinction. Well, that's not. Oh. Wait, the Charybdis really puts you to one HP. Yo, that's that's awesome, Quickly, man. Before we cut off for good. There's so many like 14 references in this game. Man. I love it. If it is like the others, the entrance to the inner sanctum will be at the foot of the crystal. We're almost there. That was a really cool fight.
guys have like 1 HP. You know why I think... Okay. You know why I think the Bahamut fight was more epic than normal? Was because of the brothers. Pet Torgo. Man, I, I can't pet him in combat. Should be dead. That stagger should have been like 70k. Yeah, Odin's battle was like mid at best. Once we step onto that bridge, we'll the cutscenes about Odin were definitely way better. The Titan fight quickly. was like fucking. I feel like Titan. Titan was S tier. Bahama was better than Titan. But Titan was so good, man. The only reason I think Bahamut was better than Titan was because of the fucking. Come on, man. Fuck. What are you waiting for? Oh. What? Stop. Stop. Oh, God, dude. Stop targeting on the fucking enemy that I'm not even looking at! Dagger, fuck. Wow. Sending my fucking laser. 